everybody immerse yourself. Here's where we're at, okay? Before, before I just start moving. Here's where we're at. So, last time on Sonic X. Last time. We finished all the regions. We went and finished all the tiers of the kingdom. We found out where Zelda truly is. Turns out, spoilers, she was... I'll give you one more second to get out of the stream. Um, she was a dragon in the sky the whole time? Powering up the Master Sword? Okay. So we got the Master Sword. We got the Master Sword. And then, that was an amazing moment. One of my favorite gaming moments ever. Ever. Zapex, have a good night, too. Have a great night. Have a great night. Thank you. Um, and then we scaled the castle with all the the friends we've made, all the sages we've made along the way. We went to Gerudo, we cleaned up Gerudo, and then we came with all of our friends, we scaled the castle, and then we fought a bunch of Phantom Ganons, right? And then we found out that the puppet Zelda was Ganon the whole time. We already kind of knew that, though, from the, the tears and everything. But, alas, there's one more sage we're apparently missing. The sixth sage. I think... It's Raru's sister, Minoru. And we gotta go find where Minoru is, or at least where the Sixth Sage is, because Minoru was at least the holder of the Sixth Secret Stone. And we don't really know much about that yet. And what we end up doing is we went down this land, we activated these ruins, we did this whole like sort of Easter egg thing to spark the sky ruins here, the Thunderhead Isles, to reveal itself. So secret last island location in the map. And now we're going there now because it's now freely open to go to. And we're going to try to find the sixth sage to hopefully use all the power of the sages, all the secret stones to fight Ganon at the end of the game. Don't know what we're going to do that at, but here we go. That's where we're at right now. Pretty good recap, right? So I don't know what's going to go on here, but hopefully... We're gonna get, we're gonna see a six sage at some point. I'm hoping that it's Minoru. I guess it could also be Zelda, but Zelda is de uh, definitely a dragon right now. She's the light dragon. And I hope that there's some way we can bring her back because that was tragic. <laughs> that was really sad. It made me want to cry. Um, I don't know, man. I don't know. Let's keep moving though. The lightning helmet helps so much. Why, what is what does the lightning helmet do? Do I have that? Is it this? The charge headdress or no? Oh, I don't have it. Okay, it's okay. We'll we'll be all right. Hopefully. All right, we got some enemies there. Yeah, I got the super. This is Super Nintendo World chat from Universal. Ow! What the hell? Oh, Choo Choo Jelly. Choo Choo Jelly, leave me alone, bro. Oh my god. Wait, chat, can I use the Demon King bow and not die? Will it not use my hearts like the other stuff? Or will it? Choo-choo jelly. Doesn't apply gloom effects. Nice. Okay. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Let's send through here. I don't know what's about to happen. Hey, Evan, appreciate you. Thank you for the 35 months. Appreciate you so much. Thank you. Guys, I, I gotta say, thank y'all so much for all the subs and everything. Sub apocalypse is happening a little bit. So every every single thing counts. Um, we were at 600 last stream, and I think it dropped down quite a bit. But, dude, I just want to say I really appreciate everybody supporting over the past couple of weeks. Because, I mean, as you guys know, unemployed has been a yikes. But, I don't know. We've had good support. With this, with, with stream... With you, some YouTube videos, getting some traction with Patreon, which has been amazing. Like, there's a solid base that's been there on Patreon. There's, there's like 30 people that have been patrons for every month so far. And it's literally helped me so much, guys. And I just really appreciate that. And I, I really want to get more Patreon content out for you guys. Um, basically, now that we're through Mando, now the world is our, our oyster. We're starting to get the rhythm back in again. And I'm really excited. I am very excited. 
But we've been we've been pumping out some videos on YouTube. It's been nice, man. Yep. We have done uh, all the Final Fantasy stuff. It's been cool. I cannot wait for tomorrow. A lightning Hell makes your lightning proof. You can zap your weapons. Oh, that's oh, that's so cool. The weapons don't don't come out of your hands. That's very cool. There's a shrine somewhere. This is very odd, right? Like they're just telling me to go to this island, and I don't really know what the point of all this is yet. I guess we're gonna use a rail car. I guess. Also, chat. By the way, do you guys like my uh, my little lantern back there, <laughs> or is it distracting? I, I actually like it. Um, I think it, it kind of has a cool. It's kind of like Bloodborne-y looking in my room, if you actually saw what it looked like. Um, I hope it's like a vibe. It's a little cute, cute little light in the background to give give my stream more, more, uh, more color than just the 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 purple lights, you know. Um, I passed the shrine, did I? Uh oh. God, the lighting is crazy. Where's the shrine? It says nearby. What? Is it down there? That's the only... I'm so confused. It's acting like it's here. Or is it up top? I'm not sure. What? It's like two shrines in Ion. Bro, I don't know. I think I think we need to use rail car. I I can't figure this out for the life of me. Woo woo! I love that noise so much. Woo woo! Why are the choo choo jellies just over here? What the heck? Get me up here. Just finished this game today. It's beautiful. Can't wait to see your reaction. Oh, hell yeah. I'm excited. I'm so stoked. Just say, just finished Tears of the Kingdom. Won't spoil it for you, but I've been grinding for a while. Also, I'll get you a prime so I get back from vacation. Dude, you, you don't have to get me anything. You're never obligated. I hope you don't, you'll know that. Just being here is, is enough for me, but it is always much appreciated. But dude, like, thank you. I, how long, how many hours did you put into it if, you're, if you've been grinding? That's, that's what I'm curious about. Like, I'm at like 60 hours. I'm still not done, but people were saying that they played even longer than me and didn't finish it yet. Can't we see a Dead Night video from Noah? Yeah, me too. It's gonna be funny. You still play COD? Yeah, I mean a little bit. I'm always gonna play COD. Like anytime a new COD game comes out, I'm always gonna play it. Um, for the most part. Oh, here we go. Um, like I didn't play Vanguard's the only one I didn't buy. Um, and that's just because I was really busy playing some other stuff, I think, and then everybody was kind of ranting, so I was just like, okay, this doesn't seem like it'd be that fun to stream right now. Um, but you know me, anytime there's like a new, like, full zombies experience, I'm gonna go check it out, of course. Anytime there's multiplayer, I usually, like, people underestimate how much I like COD multiplayer. I've always liked COD multiplayer. I was, I'm pretty, like, cracked at multi- I'm way better at multiplayer than I am at zombies, which is funny. Um... But like, I can hold my own in the lobby. Like me and Noah on a team is pretty damn sick in all the betas. I, if you guys remember the Cold War beta, like all of them were screaming at me because I was constantly taking every kill with the Spaz 12. It was amazing. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I, st I still play COD. Yeah, I played I played Dead of the Night with Noah. Wait, wait, wait. Oh wait, no, that's a different person asking that question. I was about to say, if Frozen Forest asked that question, and then also knew about Dead of the Night. 
then that was that, that I'm like, wait, what? You knew. Uh, but no, uh, Ghost Gunner, I, I still play, I, I played Dead of the Night with, and Classified with Noah and Chop literally, I want to say like a, what, like five days ago? So, we still play from time to time. Heck yeah. Is this going to work? This is not going to work. How do we... It's like I need multiple fans. Will two fans do it? We're about to find out. Wow, that's not working. Should I, am I just, am I supposed to mimic this? Is that more the vibe is to mimic this chat? And use wood instead? This, this might be more light, you know? If I flip that, right? And then put this like in the middle. Throw this away. Bye bye. And then put. Oh god, oh god. Will that work? We're about to find out. Let's go, boys. Oh god. Okay, I think it's working. Let's go. Let's go, chat. Use wood instead. Don't use the metal. Okay. Oh. Hey, hey, hey. Come back. Come back. Come back. Let's, let's place you right there. Um. Wait, is that? Okay, no. It's, it's stuck. The cape on Link is sick. Thank you. I got this from doing the mazes. Seeing you live makes my night. Oh, I appreciate that. Thank you, Uncle Chris. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, here's the shrine chat. There you go. Oh, God. I can't climb. How do I get that chest, man? Unless I can just grab it. Oh, I can't. Hmm. I mean, I could just ascend to it. <laughs> the stuff flies back in line. Yeah, true. True. I need to remember I can do that. I always forget. Yep. Give me something good. Shock emitter. Okay. All right. We'll, we'll take those, I guess. Um, we got a cube battle here. Man, all of my weapons are... Even the even the master sword is just not gonna cut it. But let's go. Let's do it. Let's fight the cube. Oh my! What the heck? Where is it? Oh my god, what do I use? Maybe a 47? Uh-oh. Did I not get it? No. Yes. Go, go. Woo. Oh my goodness. Ow! Got hit my, by my own block. Damn it. 
Uh oh. Um. What is it doing? Alright, hop on. Let's go. Come on. Almost got it. Come on. Let's go! I broke my weapon. But you know what? That's okay. It's honestly okay. I need something that can fuse. Mm. Maybe put it on... Was this? Attack up? Or on the Royal Guard's Claymore? Or no, Ro let's do Royal Knight's Broadsword. Fuse. Boom. What is that? 49? I'll take it. That's That seems pretty sick, if you ask me. Seems pretty sick. Good trade-off, I would say. Oh my god. Oh! <laughs> no shield. I, ha I have my shields off because... Oh, old map. I have my shields off because I wasn't sure... Uh, uh, if they're metal or not. I don't know if I have a, 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 wood, a wood one or not. Where the hell are we going? Wait, where's... I gotta get up there. Okay, they gave me one this time. That's that's nice of them. Thank you, game. They said, you already made this, so... You don't have to do it again. Don't even worry. You don't, you don't have to do this again. Um... You know what? I don't. It's the. It's gonna be upside down in my history. I don't want that. Uh, let's do that. What if I only need one of them? Let's try it. Well, no, sir. I only need a little bit more than that. Oh God! I was about to fall off. Oh, oh God. Fight the robots. Ow! Dead. Holy chat. Soldier contract four horn? Sounds insane, dude. Um, uh, I need to eat. I need food. I'm like a full recovery, to be honest. If I should waste that, though. Eh. We can put glow on. That'd be kind of funny. Let's do a full recovery. Screw it. Let's use one. Why not? The Zonite shields are fine. Are they? Oh, you're right. You're right. They are. You're not wrong. Thank you. I did not know that. Uh oh. Oh my god. Tulin is cracked. Tulin. I didn't even shoot. Tulin's amazing. Okay, now what? Do I... Oh, I wonder if what I do... Oh, this is a cool idea. What if I... What if I go backwards and then ascend from this? That's that's my only idea right now. I don't know why you'd even want to be over here. Is there anything over here? Also, the frame rate is going crazy right now. Crazy frame rate. Um, All right, let's get ready to ascend. What? Why are we not? Hello? Hey! 
Come back. All right, now go. Come on. Oh, we got it. Let's go. That worked. <laughs> it worked. We got it. Heck yeah. New shrine chat. Let's go. Huge teleport. JC, watch you play Final Fantasy 16 demo. Got me to try out Final Fantasy for the first time ever. You, trying out Final Fantasy 16 or or another game from the franchise. I'm just curious. Which one did you try out? Also, that makes me so happy. Like, I'm I'm happy. I'm that makes me extremely happy because I I need people to share the love with. All right, people keep acting like Final Fantasy. Like not not people. Um, I just don't have any friends that are. <laughs> It into Final Fantasy like me, so I love that our community is kind of getting into it. Why? Why is he naked? Because I'm doing a battle royale mode right now. So I have to I have to survive against the constructs, dude. It's crazy out here. Let's go, baby. Bye bye. <laughs> Wait, Dad. I don't have any arrows. Whoa. Bye bye. Arrows. See ya. That's it. Now what? Oh! Go up, go up. Oh my god. What am I trying to do right now? Can I move that? I cannot. Done. Wow. No stress at all. We got it. Let's go. You in general, try the Final Fantasy 16 demo. Doyers, hell yeah. Honestly, I think 16 is probably a perfect one to get into, man. It's going to be so much fun. I really think it's going to be a lot of people's like favorite Final Fantasy. I really do. It just It's looking that way. It's very much looking that way. No, we ain't finishing tonight, right? No, we're finishing tonight. No sh... What the f <laughs> Um Your shock emitter on my shield. Let's go. We're finishing tonight. We're finishing tonight. Wait, when did you play a demo? I missed it. You missed it? Wait, how did you miss it? I post everywhere about it. Everywhere. Metro, I got I got two videos on my main YouTube channel. And I streamed all of it on Twitch. And I talk about it every day. <laughs> I feel like you've been here. I, I I know you've been on stream. How do you not know? No, you're all good. I'm just like, how? My my Discord is practically annoyed with me at this point. Because all I do, every, anytime I type in Discord, it's just like, hey guys, here's another article about 16. Hey guys, here's another article. Hey, here's another article. Hey, it's pretty hype, right? I feel like 
people are going to hate me at some point. <laughs> no, but uh, Metro's for real. Like, uh, this, I don't know, if, how do I, was, will this pull up my actual YouTube? Yeah, there you go. If you go there, my my last two videos were like both playthroughs of the demo. Uh, the one that's called Prologue is like the actual like opening act of the game. And then I, I made a video about the battle portion of the demo where you got to play around with the, the tools and everything. And granted, it's it's kind of like VODs. Like, I, they weren't like highly edited videos. They were just like the pure VODs all the way through. Because I was like, why not? I've been hyping up this game like crazy. Why not just post the full two hours of the experience? And uh, so that's what I did. And the prologue got like 30k views, which I was super happy about. I love a song of Ice and Fire series. I got similar vibes with it. Oh, yeah. They're, they're really inspired by Game of Thrones this time, so... I'm I'm stoked, man. I'm really excited. Your hype got me to try Final Fantasy 15. Dang, I hope you like 15. 15 is such a weird game. I feel like 15. I didn't like 15 a crazy amount. I mean, it's it's so different than what 16 is gonna be. Made by completely different people too. Um, I don't know if it's completely different, but a lot a lot of different people. Um, but 15 is a weird one, dude. It's a it's a weird one. It, there's a lot to, there's a lot of charm to it, but the combat's just so repetitive. But 16 looks like it's solving that issue, which is really exciting. Yeah, it's a weird game. It's it, 15 is fun to talk about though because of how weird it is, you know. I think the thing, the thing with 15 is just the open world just is really bland. Like there just isn't really much to do. It just doesn't feel like there's there's a lot of like. It's, it just feels like a lot of chore quests, and once you once the game starts becoming linear, it's like, whoa, whoa, wh why, why is the game linear now, and why do I need to watch this and play this DLC to understand what's happening? I don't know, it's weird. 16 looks like the complete opposite of that. It's like, oh, there's just it's just one experience all the way through. It's gonna be great. There's a lot of these things, dude. I'm kind of scared. Uh, I just got eaten alive. Oh my god. Holy. Yo. Who's gonna open their mouth first? What the heck is going on? Hey, open your mouth. Open your mouth. Open. Yeah, that's right. Uh-oh. There it is. I need to, like, grab all these chests. There's a lot of chests in here. Open your mouth. <laughs> I'm like a dentist. Yeah. Grab that. I just finished Final Fantasy VII Remake. No shot. How did you like it? Without spoilers, Truz. How did you like it? My first Final Fantasy game. It watched all your VODs on it. So hyped for Rebirth and 16 now. Oh, my God. Per Truz, you're going to fit in right here on stream. You're going to love the streams the next year. It's going to be great. <laughs> it's going to be a good time. Oh my god, that's like exactly kind of like what I played. Um, that's awesome. I, I really hope you enjoyed 7 Remake. That game was so fun. It's my top five games of all time. <laughs> yeah, dude. It's so freaking sick. It's just, the thing with that game, that game is like, wow, it's part one of three. And it's like... Just it keeps going, and you're like, "Whoa, how much is left? Whoa, there's this much left. How many cinematics are there?" Like, oh my god, I love it. It's so good. Strong Zonite Shield. Well, honestly, it's not that good because it's not a strong shield compared to the other ones. Give me that chest. 
There we go. Durability up. I'll take it, I guess, but... I want that little... Yeah, there, there it is. The only thing I was really confused about in the demo was the relationship between the characters. Yeah, no, I feel that. It's... The, the good thing is... Is that, that they have that new system built in, which is so cool. I highly recommend everybody use it for that game. That the um, the active time lore, where you can you can you can switch, uh, or you can press like you can hold down the PlayStation pad button and it will uh, like the touchpad, and it will like show you like really quickly everything that uh, you need to know about those characters like up to speed. In like a shortened paragraph, it's pretty cool. Um, like for for example, Jill is not related to Clive. Um, I think I think a lot of people are like, are they brother and sister? No, 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 no. They're not related. Um, interesting. What does that mean? Um, but then there's uh, you know Joshua and Clive are brothers. Um, other than that, it's kind of, it's pretty simple. It's like just the, the king and the, the, the queen of Rosaria are like Clive and Joshua's parents. Um, but I, I also think there's some stuff too having to do with like, there's probably some stuff having to do with like who's a bastard and who's not. And I don't, I don't I'm not really sure of that yet. Have to get more into it. Cause I, I wonder if they're gonna do like the Jon Snow thing where Clive's not like actually related or he is, or there's something weird going on. You know what I mean? I don't know. The flash was actually damn good. Hmm. Interesting. I thought it was all right, but I, I've i been hearing both sides of that movie. Some people think it's really good and some people are like, ah, oh, it's fine. And some people are like, oh, it's terrible. <laughs> it's like all over the place. Like all the different opinions. Kind of nuts. I thought it was all right. I want to see it again though. Just to make up my mind. Y'all gotta make me get a PS5 just for Final Fantasy games. Dude, they've been... they It's been such a, like, system seller. A lot of people are saying that PS5 has been selling a lot recently because of 16. Th the past couple weeks after the demo. And I'm like, hell yeah. Awesome. It's very cool. I love me my PS5. Where do, where do I go? I don't understand where I go right now. Like, I can go up here. Am I missing something, chat? Where the heck? Oh. This is where I came from, right? Yeah. There's... Is that a different shrine? Is that... Bro, I actually don't know. No, I need to go this way. That's where I need to go, right? No. I need to go this way. Wait, is this shrine different? I'm lost. Did I do two shrines? Or was there a shrine just over here that I did not see? Maybe there wasn't a shrine. I was thinking of shrines there. Maybe there's no shrine there. So I did that. What the f- I'm so lost. Wait, yeah, yeah, yeah. I went down here. Whoa, I'm so lost right now. I went down here to teleport in. Do I go this way? I think I go this way. I think we go this way. Because going south makes sense. That's we, we came from the north. From the north! I got a feeling Clive is the bastard of the king because the queen obviously does not care about him. Or Clive is the son of a previous marriage. Maybe, yeah. 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 I could see that. 
Um, how do I climb this with the rain, dude? Um, this is not good. What if I fly right here and then ascend from here, chat? Hack? Wall hacks? You can see what part of the island you covered the hero's path. I, I think I haven't been here. I think I'm I think I'm finally on the right path. I think I gotta go up top up here. I believe. I believe this is the way. But I need to What? Oh. Uh oh. Well, I, I am confusion. Music was lit AF. Oh, dude, the soundtrack's gonna be amazing. I, I literally cannot wait. Yeah, it's so freaking good. I cannot wait. Um, guys, I am. I am not sure. I could hold on. Let, let me use let me use a rocket. Let's make this faster. Rocket shield, baby. I got this for a reason. Let's use it. All right, I'm up top now. Now what? Chest. Grab this. Mighty Zonite Shield. Okay. Do I have one I can get rid of? No. No. Um. Why does it seem like there's something? What is that? Whoa. Did this shoot me at a certain time? It'll shoot me. Oh, that didn't work. May I have to stand on it. This has got to work, right? This has got to be where I go. Come on, lightning. Oh. 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 Oh, nice. Okay, I can shoot with shock. Oh, I did not do that. I just waited. Rip. Okay, we're in here. What is this? What is that? Jump. Hey, I don't want to do that. Yo, I don't want to do that. Did I just... Wait, was that... Was, was I supposed to do that? I'm so confused. What? I literally dropped the bow. Are you freaking kidding me? Where's my bow? Where's my bow? Oh my god. This is so bad. Rip the bow, dude. Well, I still got like a lot. Do I do I actually go to I might just say rip the bow. I don't know how to get back up there right now. We have a bunch more. I'm just gonna go down. I don't know what this is. Is this correct? Dragon Head Island. What? I'm so confused. 
Are we still in the sky? Okay, we still are in the sky. This still counts. Okay. I don't know. <laughs> I don't, I truly do not know. Raru's blessing. Can I have a bow, please? I was shooting that bow a lot, so it's probably about to break anyways. There it is, okay. But I just got a shrine done, that's it. There's no other... What? What was the point? Also, thanks guys, we have 106 viewers. Let's go, baby. We got a bunch of people in here tonight. Hell yeah. Let's go, chat. Um, whenever I, when have I really just straight besides the dark, the dark clump debacle? <laughs> what is this, though? Dragon Head Island. You bleed. Prayer. Let's pray. You have conquered the shrines and claimed the lights of blessing. Give me a heart. Yes. Chat, we have a second row of hearts. It happened. Oh, wait, or did we already have that? Maybe we already had that. Wait, did I have that the whole time? I didn't realize that. Oh, we had we had one already. I, I didn't even notice. But we were on a second row. That's awesome. Heck yeah. That's a lot of hearts. Um, now what? The music. Hell yeah, dude. I have from the castle. I did not know. Oh my god. Whoa. You have to have... How many do you have to have? 13? How many do you have to, ha to have to have for that chat? That's crazy. Whoa. What are we about to find out, man? I'm excited. Let's turn it up. Yo, God. <laughs> oh, my God. What? Link, Zelda's chosen protector. Minoru? Take this. Follow the light. What the f what? <laughs> what? Do I wear it? Is this a Majora's Mask reference chat? Oh. Guidance from ages past. Oh, this might be one of my favorite soundtracks in the game. Pick up. It says pick up. You found a strange relic on Dragonhead Island that emitted a narrow beam of light. The beam appears to extend straight down the surface. When you touch the relic, a mysterious voice said to take it and follow the light. Do I have to take this all the way down somehow? This is so cool. What? Oh, we're going to put it on a bird. Yo. Put it right, right there.
Let's do uh should I build? I'm gonna build it. I know I, I have an auto build for this, but that there. Bring it back. And then let's put a rocket on it for good measure. Right underneath. I'm ready. Make sure this is more centered. I'm ready. I'm gonna do a quick save. This is so cool, chat. What? I'm so excited. Let's do it. Oh my god. To dodge all these rocks. Come on. Come on, land. Put it right there. Oh! There it is. We made it. Oh. Yo, God? <laughs> what a special game. Yeah, this game is something special. It's so cool. Big burb. Big bird. Oh. Let's run in. I want to see what it is. Let's go. Oh, let me fix my hair. Because it's bothering me. Oh. <sighs> Okay, all right. Let's move this down. The light. Tobio's Hollow Chasm. Elevator? How is this game not over yet? How is it not done? Whoa! Link. Zelda's chosen protector. You must hurry. We must meet as soon as possible. Is Minoru still alive? That'd be crazy. The hair looking scrum diddly umptious. Thank you, Metro. Thank you. Thank you. Chat, I'm ready. What the hell is this? What? What? 
Let me grab this first. Where am I at? Oh my goodness. Wait, was this here before? That'd be crazy if you could get here like normal. I guess you could. That's odd. Now, hold on. Really fast. I want to go grab this X. <laughs> give me a... Give me a second, you know? I'll go grab it. If I can. If the game will let me. Oh, we're getting close. Look how far down that is. Damn, I guess it was like literally impossible to get up to where we were. Where the f I'm so confused right now. What? Does this take me outside? Uh oh. Oh, this definitely took me outside. Oh God. Oh God. <laughs> What the f Guys. Huh? <laughs> Where the hell am I, dude? Oh, the Quark Force is back to normal. But I guess it's back to normal. That makes me happy. Yay. Aw. Well... That was, that was wild. Um, yeah, it looks like I probably can't get to that X mark. That's okay. That's all right. That's all right. You know, see, every time I try to go for those chat, they're always somewhere else. So I guess back to the temple thing that we're going to, I don't know. I don't know. You tell me, I, I have no idea what's going on. I really don't know. People arrive. People arrive. What the hell is this do? Construct factory. What? your next song on your list after you choose the kingdom Final Fantasy 16 tomorrow night I'm so stoked I'll pick this up I'm just gonna walk this over here but yeah we're, we're gonna be Final Fantasy gaming for a while after this I keep on taking this thing to places and I'm supposed to place this Oh my god. Construct? Are we birthing a lad? Link, Zelda's chosen protector. Is this Minoru? My name is Minoru. <laughs> 
I am the Sage of Spirit. Are you a construct now? I am happy you have arrived. Of spirit. At last we can speak with each other. Unfortunately, I no longer have a body. Minoru is an android! Without a physical form. We cannot yet speak face to face. Oh my god. Minoru's an android chat. But, do you see the four <laughs> storehouses in the area? I would ask you to visit each of them and assemble a body for me. What? This is so cool. This is my request to you, Link. Loyal swordsman to Zelda. So I need, I need to find more body parts. Got it, got it, got it. Oh my God, it's like building clockwork in Sly Cooper. Um, Cause she kind of looks like an owl or something. This is so cool. We're building a body for Minoru. Let's go over here. Let's go this green light. First thing I see. Have you played any X Fine? I did a couple months ago, and I thought it was alright. I, I, I thought it was okay. It, it might be a lot better now, though. I will not be playing this weekend, though. I'm playing Final Fantasy, guys. I, Again, I feel like I talk about every stream, but truly... I will literally not be playing anything but Final Fantasy for probably like two weeks straight. At least. Like, to be completely honest with you. <laughs> maybe I might take a break here and there. Maybe, but I don't know. It's my most hyped game in the last two years. What the heck is going on? Alright, we're opening up that. This is the body. This is the body right here. But what do we... What do I do with this? How do I... What? My body's in here. Right. Oh! What does this do? Drain the water. Oh no, that's like electricity? What the f Oh, it's also this thing. Ooh, let's do... Let's throw some cores in there. Promise I'll be here tomorrow. Dude, I appreciate it. I appreciate any, any support on it. It's gonna be so much fun. Vader says, dog, X Define can't catch a break. I can see it. I can't see it. Are you saying I can? I can't see the game pick up if it gets more gameplay complexity and content. I can see the game pick up if it gets more gameplay complexity and content, but there are, are like 5,000 free to play first person shooters coming out. By big AAA devs, uh, Marathon, Arc Raiders, all live service stuff. We saw the showcases that Sony's putting their fingers in. Ubisoft have, has been having rough, man. Yeah, I mean, I mean, to put, put it simply, it's like, it's like, that. that's, it's what I said before about X Defiant, right? I'm re, I'm really, I, I hope the devs have success. I really do. But what I don't want is I don't like it when people. I don't like it when people use a game just to put down another game. You know what I mean? Like, X Defiant looks cool, but if you're too afraid to put X Defiant in the title of your YouTube video, I'm talking about content creators here, and you can only put Call of Duty should do be doing this, Call of Duty, Call of Duty, Call of Duty, Call of Duty, it's never going to ever become Call of Duty. Because you cannot stop yourself from mentioning Call of Duty when you play it. And it's like, I don't know. Like, like is that healthy for that game long term? I don't know. Probably not. You'd probably want it to be its own thing, its own community. And and I, I just don't like it when people use games as like, like, to go to war with another game. You know what I mean? It's like, if, you, if you're genuinely, oh, it's lowering the bridge. If you're genuinely excited for about X Defiant, be excited about X Defiant. Make videos about X Defiant without putting down Call of Duty every single time. You know what I mean? Yeah, biggest mainstream appeal of X Defiant so far has been like it plays like old COD. Yeah. Exactly. It's like 
how how many times can you can you do something like that? Like, I don't know. How many times can you make a video about that? At a certain point, these guys are not gonna have much to say. They're gonna be like, oh, it's like called oh, it's like Call of Duty. <laughs> so that's what I'm that's what I'm worried about is because I I don't want people just to pick it, pick up the game just to make a statement and then throw it down and be like, oh well. I was just, I was just saying, I was just playing it and saying it just to have a statement. But you know, when Modern Warfare 3 comes out, I'm, I'm gonna be making videos about that. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know. There's a lot of hypocrites that do that all the time. And I mean, it's not the biggest deal in the world or anything. I just think that I want to see games succeed because people are like, okay, this game is really fun or this game is awesome. Not, oh, this game is. I'm using this as a vessel for clicks. You know. So that's the only thing that makes me nervous about X Defiant. I don't know. I don't know. It's like with something like Titanfall or something, it's a little bit different because it's like Okay, Titanfall has its kind of own spin on things. It's like, oh, like when Titanfall happened, it's like, oh, there's advanced movement for the first time. That's crazy. Oh my God, there's these things called Titans. Like there's that like special sauce that, that like Respawn put into the game that really differentiated it. Where it's like, okay, it's not just COD. It's like, it's it, it started out as COD probably, but then it became this special formula that everybody really likes, right? Um, and. I, I, I guess that's what I'm looking for for X Defiant is I'm like, okay, I I don't know if it's enough for me personally to be super invested in a game that's just COD MP. Um, you know, I, I, I don't know. Um, I think I, I need some sort of special sauce or something that, that, that like, what, what's the, what's the hook beyond something I ha I've already played and seen a billion times, you know? And that's no offense. I, I just, I hope that they find it. I really do hope that they find it with the game. I'm talking about caught on a breath of the water. It's here's the Kingdom Stream chat. <laughs> my my Nintendo uh, viewers are like, huh? <laughs> huh? Uh, how do I? What what am I doing with this? Do I do I pull these down? Oh, what the hell? Whoa. Does the laser stop them? What, what are these? Oh, it's Zonite. Why is Zonite, like, nailed into it? I'm so confused. Um, I came in here, right? I need to use that box. Oh, I'm lost. I guess you use those. What? Oh, I'm. It's like I need to. I need to like attach the rocket to the box. Yep. But what was the point of this? Why why would I need to go up here? Is there anything even up here? There's a chest. Like I wanna know how to How do I Do I hold this above my head? Holy hell, that actually worked. Okay. Nice. Now do the same thing. Got it. Wow, that actually was kind of sick. It's 
put this over here on this this thing. I somehow have to get the box up here. But that that's the issue is I don't It's like I need to to ramp this a certain way. Like I need You know what I'm saying, chap? I, I think I think I, I have the right idea. Hold on. Like that and then we put this rocket here like that and then we lift this up maybe <laughs> um I, I guess that works. I'll take it. <laughs> and then it's there. Okay, yeah, that was what we're supposed to do because they put a guardrail there. Nice. And now we grab this, move it back this way. And let's, let's go skate. Let's be a skater boy. Maybe it doesn't matter. Maybe nothing matters. There's a rocket though in here, I thought. Don't you call me a skater boy? Oh my god, that looks terrible. Oh jeez. Wow, that actually kind of worked. What? What do I do with this, though? Oh! It breaks. Nice! One leg. Hell yeah. We'll be playing Final Fantasy on stream. It comes out 100% day run. Bring the other three here as well, Link. Tomorrow at 9 p.m. is when it comes out. Around the same time we went live tonight. But yes, and uh, open for your interpretation, chap, or what what you guys want. I I I will ultimately make the decision on this. But very curious what you guys think. What do you think we should do? Um, because the demo was essentially the prologue, right? Should we do the prologue again or no? I'm thinking no. I'm thinking we start after the prologue. But I'm kind of curious what you guys would think about that. Because it saves your progress. It saved your progress from the demo. Like, technically, we kind of did our part one already. But I'm curious. Because because the prologue was... Keep in mind, the prologue was like two hours. And so I'm like a little bit like nervous about like, hey guys, Final Fantasy XIV is out. Let's just play the same thing again for two hours. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I don't know if I want to do that. I'm not sure. Like, it was, a, it took me a bit to get through it. And also, I've, I've watched probably like 50 videos of reactions to the prologue. So I've seen the prologue so many times at this point. That I'm like, bro, do I really need to see that again? I don't know. Do you think it would change anything from the demos released in the prologue part? Um, the No, I don't think so. I think the only thing that they, they changed was... Um, what do you call it? Uh, I think the only thing they changed was the second part of the demo, which doesn't count as the prologue. You know what I mean? Like the iconic abilities part where you, uh, you know, like do like the whole like Garuda fight and everything. Um, I don't, I don't think that that, that, that's going to be different. I think in the main game, you're not even going to have, 
because they gave you Garuda's abilities in that, and I don't think you're even going to have Garuda's abilities. So that we would replay naturally whenever we get to it. The whole Benedicta bit. But I uh, I think the overall, I think the, the prologue itself, like, yeah. basically, where the prologue ends, where, where Clive's like this, and he goes, Joshua, Joshua. And he says that last word, and then it says, thanks for playing. Like, that's where it would pick up from. It's right there. Which I think is pretty good. Maybe a quick refresh to the prologue? Yeah, I feel like we could do that. Yeah. We could do that. Also, what the hell? Where am I going, man? I'm so confused. Is that where we need to go? How do I... I'm going to go back this way. They did say that they... Uh, so, so what's really funny, they said that they weren't going to do a day one patch, right? They said that there's going to be no day one patch required. And then uh, they turned around like this past week and they said, we are going to patch some stuff. Sorry. We're really, really sorry. We're going to patch some stuff, which I, I'm fine with. Please patch some stuff, please. Um, and... Uh, and they said that they they worked on performance issues. They worked on some crash issues. Um, there was someone I I don't know if it's someone who who has access to the game or not. Um, do you guys know who uh, Susie is on Twitter? Sphere Hunter. I think it's I think her her handle is Sphere Hunter. Yeah, Susie Hunter. Um, she tweeted, and everybody's like, "You got to be talking about Final Fantasy, right?" All right, get, listen to this tweet. Okay, listen to this. There's a tweet. She tweet. This is 22,000 likes on Twitter, right? This is June 19th. This is yesterday. This has got to be... I assume this is about Final Fantasy. Because if people have early codes and stuff, they can't say it. they have it yet until tomorrow. So she, she tweeted this. She said, I'm playing a game that isn't out yet where a boss fight made my PS5 overheat so much that it turned off completely. <laughs> So if you guys plan on <laughs> buying any new games in the near future for day one, make sure you clean it, clean out your PS5 thoroughly. Oh my god. And she says, if you've had your PS5 for a long time, get a Torx security screwdriver, T8 or T9 heads, and seriously open that thing up and just clean that fan and heat sink. You won't regret it. And all the replies are, damn, when he said come to me ifrit, they really brought Ifrit to your console. They really did, dude. Oh my god. They literally... Your PS5 might combust at some point. I'm like, bro, what? So, apparently, though, there's a patch for some things. So, hopefully, hopefully the performance is good. But that's crazy. I've never even... Ha I've never heard of that. My, my PS5 turning off? Huh? I just, I just pray it isn't like Jedi Survivor. I pray. The demo ran pretty fine for me. I wasn't like too concerned about the demo. It ran pretty well. Um, so I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what that's about. If that's Final Fantasy, that's crazy. That's really crazy. You know what would help you get to the areas of parts a lot faster? What? What? What, what, what? Are oh, they closed me out again? I gotta... I assume I push this up, then recall it. Yeah. I've been playing Fallout on Game Pass. It survivors PC performance performance that bad? Yeah, it was pretty bad. I mean, I played it on console, and I still had problems on console. Um, it got better with some patches, but. I mean, I assume it's better now, quite a bit. But yeah, it, it was it was pretty rough for me. I still really enjoyed the game though; it was awesome. But yeah, I definitely could tell I wasn't playing at full sixty. Um, but yeah, what the heck do I do with this, dude? Do I put a controller on my box? Huh? There's a fan. What? What in the world? Oh, 
I'm gonna put a controller on it. <laughs> I don't know if this will work. <laughs> Please! Um, well maybe, oh, take the tires off. Yo, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what you do, dude. That's what you do, take the tires off. Heck yeah, brother. Let's do that. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. Hell yeah. No, 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 no. All right. We may be fine. That controller's gone. Um. Okay, maybe it's not. Maybe we're okay. But that way? I think it's really the same way I had it. I think. Thing behind me? No. Let's go. This is so cool. What? I want. I want more puzzles like this. I feel like this is this is like some puzzles that we very much needed. Um. What does that do? Attach the tire thing to this too. Why is there a ladder? What? Why is there a ladder, chat? Why, why can I? What? Why, why won't they let me use this? the heck? Yo, Crazy Poe gameplay? Grand Poe. Oh, give me 20. Nice. Oh, there's a chest over there. Are you kidding me? How am I supposed to get to that? Probably shouldn't have done this. Let's go, dude. Let's go. Let's go. I, I really wanted that to be more than just five steering sticks. I'm going to be honest. Come on. Come on, man. Right, let's grab this. All right, why do we have the fan? What's the point of the fan? What's the point of that? Why do, why do we need a fan?
Oh, maybe use the fan propeller for the box. That'd be kind of cool. That'd be kind of sick, actually. Let me try that. Oh, I can't. Oh, that'd be so cool. I, I guess you just do this. The steering sticks. This has got to work, right? Come on, baby. Oh my god, this is sick. Yo. Uh-oh. Well. Well. Uh-oh. Swap this around really fast. What? Ooh. Are you kidding me? Do I have to drop you in the water? We got it, we got it, we got it. Uh oh. We move, we move, we move. There we go. Heck yeah. What was that? Yes. This one. Yes. That's two, chat. Two more. Two more. And that's oh. another heart. Two left. You see the Smosh News, JC? I did. Sorry, I, I think I answered that earlier, but my brain's not working. But yes, I did. I am so happy that they're back, dude. That was like my childhood. Did you guys hear about that? Ian and Anthony from Smosh are back together. They bought Smosh back from Rhett and Link's uh, company, and they literally, like, are going to make, like, classic Smosh vids again. Like, actually. Like, what the heck? Are we building freaking Exodia? I don't know. I truly don't know. Okay, here's... There's a, there's a green light over here, so I assume this is one way we got to go. Oh. Hey, let's just descend really fast, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, 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 yeah. How do we get over there? Can I ascend? I think I can. Yes. Yes! Yes, chat. Right arm depot. Whoa. Part number three. Give it up for part number three. That's news to me. Can you believe some people are so young they don't know the smashes? I mean, it was a long time ago, to be fair. I never watched Smash. I didn't know. Yeah, I mean, a lot of this stuff was bad, but like. But I'm talking about like OG days of YouTube. Like, you gotta have some respect for Smosh in the OG days. You know what I mean? Like, they were like one of the pioneer channels back in the day. I uh, like they were the skit channel. Like, oh my god! I, whoa, this looks sick, by the way. What the heck? 
What in the world, guys? What? How in the world do you do this? This is crazy. It's like a pinball machine or something. Like, could I just put the box like... Bye bye. <laughs> it's an escalator. Yo? What the hell, dude? What is this? Why is this all shocky? What? There's a ladder. Um... This is odd. I need to turn off the electricity somehow. I'm gonna go down here. Because I don't know... Whoa, this takes you back up there. Whoa, okay. What about this way? Oh, there's a chest. I'll take that. Okay. A lot of, a lot of zonite. How do I stop the electricity? It's like I need I need to like turn it off somehow. That didn't do anything. Um We have these parts. Spider on your mic again. Dude, oh my god, don't tell me that. Oh my god. <laughs> oh Kavagus, thank you. Dude, I, that got me like scared. Now I'm like seeing like little things on my mic. It's bothering me. Oh no. Oh no, chat. Heck no. Chat, how's the audio quality of my streams nowadays? Do you guys like the new mic? I've been using it for like a couple months now. And I don't know. You guys might not even notice, but I hope it's been pretty good lately. It is all right. All right. <laughs> Is it better than all right? <laughs> I don't want to just be all right. <laughs> Hell yeah, huge zonite. Okay, I think this is the next area, which I shouldn't even be at. I gotta figure out how to get the block over there somehow. Is someone be a three lives when the Halo 3 theme? What? <laughs> what? That's amazing. Shout out to them. I'm about to get shocked. Ow. Um. Man, I truly do not know. Maybe I'm supposed to put the the one that was down here. Maybe I go grab this. So why was there just one chilling here? I don't know. I hate that to put my volume at full blast using my headphones because the sounds, the sounds so low. Wait, my stream is too low for you? Actually? For real? Uh oh. I I have it's crazy. I have a a. I have a gain of like, what do you call it? Um. Oh. I have a gain of like five 
added to my stream through OBS to make make it louder. Yeah, it's probably I don't know. I th I think. Do you have that uh, problem with other streamers, or is it just me though? So I'm curious about. What the heck? Why can't I put this in here? What? It's everyone for me. Yeah, damn. It might be just twitch.tv, baby. It might be just OBS as well. Like, the stuff that we use. What the heck? I don't understand this. This makes no sense. Like... These need to all work together. Do the electrical thing? I don't see anything. I have no idea why it's electrical. Angles. Does the park conduct electricity? Let's see. Wait, I wonder if... Because... What... Wait, do you... Why do I feel like this is right? This has got to be it. Dude. If this is it... That's actually... Yeah, that might be the coolest puzzle in the entire game. That is so cool. What? That, that genuinely might be the best puzzle in the whole game. That was so sick. What the heck, chat? That was awesome. All right, now what? We gotta go down there. This part's probably just for fun. Let's create the ultimate car. Steering stick in here. There we go. It's 
Let's grab a little charge from this guy. Or did I already do that? I think I already did. Woo! I just ran over it because I had the lightning helmet. I was lightning proof. That's actually so sick. What? So you play this game after I had to slog through the puzzles and Atomic Heart makes me so mad. Usually I'm really bad with puzzles. I don't know what's going on. It's probably because it helped from you guys too. Because you guys kind of tell me, hey, look again at something. I'm like, oh. Oh. Oh my god, we're still alive. Come on. Let's go. Oh, we're good. We're good. Let's go, baby. Nice. One more. This is so sick. I love this. This has been really cool. One more left, Link. The oh. body from my spirit is nearly complete. Time to complete the body. Okay, the last one I didn't go to. Yeah, they're off. It's just that green light. The, the lights turn off when, when you're done. So I need to go over here somehow. I need to find my way up to the top of that. They guide me sort of this way first. I'll grab some pose. I'm scared of these enemies though. Should a, a blight a blight bloom? Um. A giant? Do I have? Do I? Have, oh, I didn't even know I had giant ones. Okay, it looks like. It's like I need to like a. up here oh my god it's like I wonder if you can climb hold up why do they give you this why do they, why do they give you this freaking block like they give you this for a reason Hell yeah, chat. Let's go. Let's freaking go. 
We made it. We found a way. It's not meant to be a, pu a puzzle. There's ramps. What? I didn't see anything. Wait. I don't know. I Hey, I made it in. I made it in somehow. I don't know how, but I did. We made it here. <laughs> it was in the dark. Rip. Rip. <laughs> Let's go. Oh. You raise me up. <gasps> oh god. What the hell is this, dude? Okay, I attached that. Oh. oh! Maybe attach underneath. Yes. What the hell is this? What? I assume... Should I go up here? It's almost like I need to use... It's almost like I need to grab the ramp somehow. But how? There's one there. What? Hold on. Let me cook. Let me cook. Let me cook. There's a ramp here. slides backwards. Hey, can you, not, can you not do that, please? Thank you. There we go. Hey, give me one more. No shot. <gasps> what am I doing? do it this way. I'm, oh my god. There's no shot, guys. <laughs> the 
There's no way, bro. Oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. Here's the here's the issue. What do I do here? This this is this is an issue. right there's <laughs> dude there's no way oh <laughs> what was the solve on that what was this there were fans on the elevator? Oh! <laughs> oh! Oh! Hey, it worked! It worked, chat! You know? It absolutely worked. We found a way. Walking on a tightrope. To move things around. Oh my goodness. That's so funny. I... Hey. I don't know what I was doing, but it's it somehow worked in the end. I, I don't know how. Like, are, are these fans just broken? Why are these fans broken, dude? What, why is this? There's like definitely a railing here. What the f Does this not work? Oh, my, my battery's low. Oh my god. <sighs> there we go. You raise me up. What the f? What is going on? Um. Oh, here's a chest. And a stick again. I don't know. Honestly, your solution required way more skills, so. Yo, thank you. Thank you. Heck yeah. This stick on here. Can you imagine if I was doing this last night at like 4 a.m.? Screw that. I'm so glad I didn't. I'm so glad. Oh my gosh, like a fly just came to my face. What the heck, dude? Why is there a fly around me? Whoa. Alright, we must put the block there. I wonder if we can... This would be so heavy. Oh my gosh. But it might work. Fly did what? Yo. 
Yo, you got a dirty mind, Pringle. Dirty mind, Pringle over here. You know what I meant. You know. I'm guessing if I have all of these, it'll work. We'll see, though. Yes. Please. Please work. Oh my god. Whoa. Let's grab these really fast. Heck yeah. There you go. Ugh. Drop it. Oh, shoot. Please fall. Yes. And there's the last one chat. We did it. Woo. Give it to me. There we go. Break. There it is. There it freaking is. That was a really cool, like, temple type of thing. I don't know what that was, but that was great. Oh, she a big robot. She's a reclaimer from Halo. She's guilty, Spark. Mm-hmm. Wait, there's something else I have to say. <laughs> Minoru! Let's go! Thank you, Link. Now only one task remains. Okay. We must recover my secret stone. Dude, how much more is there? What? What? It should be located here. What? Please, Link. Let us go there together. Together? What is- The path will be very dangerous. Fortunately, this construct body you have built for me is hardly helpless. There is a platform nearby where we can explore its potential. Okay. Oh. Oh my. Now hurry, Link. We must recover my secret stone. What does this mean? What the heck? Whoa! Minoru's construct abilities. Link can ride on Minoru's construct? What? Yo. Yo! You get a mech? Titanfall, yeah! Oh my god, this is sick! You can attach. Left hand, right hand. Oh my. Dude. Link, the weapons here draw forth the true power of this construct. Attach one to a hand, you'll, and your power and combat will be magnified. Wow. Uh -huh. I'm. I love this. What? Minerus construct abilities. You can attach things to the hands or back of Minerus construct. What? The attached objects can augment the construct's movement or combat abilities. What are they on about with this? Whoa. You can literally, like, attack. This is so cool. Back part. Attach. Oh my god. Let's do right hand. Oh my goodness. Let's 
to attach left hand and let's do attach back part yes dude this is badass where do they want us to go they want us to go this way put a fan on the back immediately can you imagine can you just run faster with that Oh my god, what? <laughs> I wish they'd keep the music, not this music. I want the other music to come back. What does this do? Does this shock them? What does this do, man? getting destroyed. The guarding's crazy. You can parry. Uh-oh. Let's just keep running. Let's just keep running. You can grab stuff while you can grab stuff while on on it. That's so sick. Oh, grab stuff up here. We move, we move, we move. Dude, this is sick. What? All right, keep going. A fan. Wait, can a fan actually? What? Yes. Yes. So we grab. Can we swap? Oh, you can really swap. That is badass, dude. Kind of curious what a rocket will do, but. Oh my god, chat. So I'm trying to get used to what the buttons are. Um, it attaches block or something. Yeah, dude. Hell yeah. Right, let's go back park. We go. Go. Move out, team. Yeah. All right. Ow! I'm going to die. I'm genuinely going to die to the gloom. What do I have? Sit down, bro. Sit down. Sit down. Yeah. Get parried from a mech. Sit down. Get out of my house. Bye-bye. 
All right, recharge. <laughs> All right, we need, we need a boost over there as soon as it recharges. All right, here we go. Ready? We need to attach parts. Yeah, I need it. Let's... Let's go. Let's go forward first. Huge. What is this? Hmm. Is that some proper weapon? Well, able able to, to attack distant enemies. A beam! The beam chat! Hey! <laughs> Yo! Yo! Dude, I'm getting destroyed by these guys. Am I out? I might be out of cannon. I'm out of cannon. You can shoot your bow from the back as well. What is this? Have I never gotten one of those before? What? Whoa. Let's freaking go. That's so sick, dude. The beam is so awesome. The question is, where do we go? We go through there? I assume so. We move! Go! Out of power. We are out of freaking power, dude. I'm scared. I'm scared. Beam. Bye bye. <laughs> bye bye. Bye bye. Maybe we should maybe we should move. Bomb flower. No, 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 no. We move, we move, we move. Can I jump? No. Oh, what the f- <laughs> They don't stand a chance. With this, they do not stand a chance. With these upgrades. They stand a chance. 
How the hell did I get up there? How do I... Hold on, let's recharge for a second. Let's grab this. Yes. Grab it, grab it, grab it. Oh, that's better. That's much better. Actually, C. It's a lot of hearts. Okay. Should probably heal up. Oh my god. Oh my Gerudo bow. No. No, no. See ya. God, these guys have a lot of items. Dude, this is so cool. Why did they save a mech for last? Chat, I predicted ice powers for Minoru. Instead, she's a robot android that I can ride on like Titanfall. What has happened? Like, what is going on right now? This is crazy. I was down when you said that because I knew what was to come. But yeah, this is nuts. Oh my. Yeah, we shoot bombs, baby. Are we good? We keep shooting. Oh, it didn't do any damage. Oh, God. This guy looks strong as hell, chat. My friends are at least fighting him. That's nice. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. my friends where's where's Riju where are you there we go that's some friendship right there, chat. Huge friendship. Huh? Woo! They have a good bow? What'd he drop? What's this? Take that. Let's move out. the turn out did I forget something? Chat, did I forget something? Check phone. What? Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh, chat. Poor Emmy. Poor Emmy. Emmy's reading a book. Criminal behavior. Criminal behavior. 
Okay, I think I need to grab that chat, right? Why can't I grab that? There we go. There we go. I assume this is the right way. We're close now to the secret stone. Draw forth the hidden power in this contract. Impress What is it? What do you mean by that? What do you What do you mean by that? Wait, something was about to break. Yeah, this fan's about to break. Let me let me get rid of it. Let's recharge. Just rock this. Let's go. You use your large not charges. Oh, true. I always forget about those. But I don't like wasting them. Oh my god. Hold up. Not use your your cannon until your battery goes back up. Is that a thing, chat? How's that work? I probably should. Um, oh, there you go. You can walk over it. Oh, we got it. We got it. Don't even worry, we got oh my Dude, look at all this. Are you kidding me right now? Look at all this zonite. Dude. That's criminal. There's so much. Let me recharge. Recharge, recharge. They're just teasing me with that. They're like, hey, please grab this. Look at all that. Oh my goodness. I want a little bit more. Give me a little bit more. chat. Heck yeah. Alright, that does it. That's enough for me. It's enough for me, baby. Grab these pose, and then we're good. I believe. Me down there. That is scary. Kind of want to avoid them. Is it here? How am I supposed to get it up top? Put a rocket on its back? What? How am I supposed to do this? Um. 
Rocket on its back, maybe? I'm gonna try this. Back part and then... Oh, God. That... How do we do that? Put it on the back. But how do we boost forward? You can steer it when he's flying. Wait, I can? Let me try. Oh, okay, we can. Nice. Spirit Temple. Jesus. The vessel spirit's resting resting place. What? I barely made that jump. Okay. What are you? That's what we need to go to, right? Maybe I go to it with the construct? Yes. Whoa. Dude, this whole ending section is so interesting. Like, what? The owls. The owls, dude. What are they doing? Teleport spot, nice. Okay. All right. I'll take that. I'll take it. Oh. Oh. oh, there it is. We move. This looks like a boss fight arena, though. This just looks like an arena. Why would they make it this large? Maybe. Oh, I was like, maybe not. <laughs> oh, God. What am I about to fight, dude? Uh oh. Oh, no. No, please let me get to my fridge. I'm hungry. Please, Mama, let me eat. I need a snack. Oh my god, it's another one. Oh, it's a wrestle match. That construct. Whoa. I made it long ago. But the glow. It must be under the control of something monstrous. I love her voice. Seized construct. If the Demon King has turned my creation into his pawn, we Whoa. must defeat it. We can do this together, Link. Oh my god, it's like a wrestling... What the f... Let's go. We have to stop that Huge concept. rockets, baby. Let's go, dude. Is there anything I can grab? We gotta go over here now. Yo, huge. Sit down, son. This thing is quite sturdy. We keep knocking it over, but that is all. That yeah. Was... Oh my god, it's like the Sonic Adventure 1 fight against the robot in Amy's story. Dude. You have to hit it against the, the end of the... The end of the thing, and then he gets damaged, just like the robot in that game. Ow! Devices are very dangerous. Careful. Get away from me! Oh my God, chat! Get out of here! Bye bye. 
Yeah! Get lasered, B. Oh, shit. <laughs> this is sick, dude. This is so sick, chat. Oh my god. I'm actually parrying it well and stuff, too. What is that, bro? I need other items in the arena. I need something that I can run around with. Like, throw me a fan, for God's sake. You brought out more arms. Be careful. Oh, he has fans now. Can I have a fan? Wait, hold up. Hey, hey. Drop that fan real fast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, God. Yeah. What the hell? Run. Bye bye. Yeah. Oh my god, all the parts are falling off now. Run. Use the fan to dodge. <laughs> Dude, it's like it's like the freaking uh what is it? The beta fight? E101 beta fight with Gamma and Sonic Adventure now. Oh my god. This is sick. Bro. I can't use my damn super suit. Yeah, get knocked out of the sky, dude. Yeah, get melee. Yeah, get out of here. Bye bye. <laughs> get out of here, dude. Get out of my house. No, I'm good. Oh. Run, 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 run. He's about to come in. It has to stop moving to attack. Wait for that moment. That's it. You're done. That's the finale. I got you. Oh. One more. Bye bye. <laughs> It's the way I go. You've almost done it. Get parried. You are li literally get out of my house, dude. <laughs> get out of my house, dude. bird flies out. I'm secretly a bird the whole time. That might be one of my favorite boss fights in the game. That is so sick. That is so freaking sick. You're you're basically playing like Zelda Titanfall in a wrestling ring. That was awesome. God. Oh, man. Oh, that was so sick, chat. Doing any after in game stuff, or are you ready to move on? Uh, for now, I'm ready to move on at once I beat the game, but we will see if I want to pick it up again later. Oh my god. I love it. I absolutely love this. Let's go. For now, this is the last Zelda stream for a bit because I'm going to be addicted to Final Fantasy, but this by no means do, do I not like this game. I, I've loved this game, chat. This is, this is episode 13. Of our playthrough. That's a lot of streams, man. I feel like we took our time with it. We did. We really did. Hey, Kitsune, what's up? What's Whoa. going on, TC? How have you been? It's been a while since I've been around and caught up on what I've missed. 
How are you doing? Dude, we're doing and so good. How is it being able to be a full time streamer again? Dude, it is. Kitsune, wait, hold on. Hold on one second, Kitsune, because I just want to see this. Hold on, hold on. I don't know what's going on. Zelda asked me to aid you, Link. I am the Sage of Spirit, and one of the Zonai. Minoru! Yay! The Sage of Spirit. I am glad to meet you, Link. I must thank you. It is because of you that we have recovered my secret stone. She's so cool looking. Originally, my intent was to awaken when you first found the Pora Pad. Pora then Pad. to guide you to my construct and assist you on your journey. I had not anticipated a battle with that same construct. You have proven quite adept, and I am grateful for all your efforts. Link, here. Yes. Yes. In the name of Minoru, Sage of Spirit, I grant my power unto you. I believe it will serve you well. Oh my god. Can we call on this mech anytime now? What the heck? With this power I've given, a deep bond has been forged between us. And from this point forward, my spirit will reside within that construct. I will help you however I can. Our scarf looks like the shrines, yeah. Where does the story go from here? Uh -huh. Okay, let me read Kitsune's thing. So Kitsune said, what's going on, JC? How you been? It's been a while since I've been around. I caught up on what I missed. Uh, I caught up on what I missed. How are you doing? How's it been able to be a full-time streamer again? It's been good. I also, hello, welcome back, Kitsune. Um, it's been good. I. I like that I've had a little bit more time during my days to like do some stuff that I want to do and like actually go hang out with Emmy or whatnot. But I've been streaming a lot. I've been grinding the streams a lot lately. Um, I mean, there's been some long 12 hour streams I've done in the past couple weeks that have been pretty insane. I think I did like a 18 hour stream at some point. And so, I don't know. It's It's been really fun. It's been good just to kick back, relax and play some like game of the year nominees. You know what I'm saying? Like this especially, we got Final Fantasy next. I want to play some more Diablo. Again, I've heard amazing things and I'm barely through that game. Like, just overall, I, I, I've been pretty happy, to be honest. It, you know, it was unfortunate circumstances that like led me to get to this point, but the, I think it's a blessing in disguise in some ways. I get to go chill out for a bit, play some stuff I want to play, take a breather, and then job hunting as well has been going very good, so. I don't know, man. I'm I'm really hyped for the future. Like I'm doing pretty well. I randomly look at Twitch at like 4 a.m. before bed and would see you're still streaming. I thought you were insane. <laughs> true, 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 true. Yeah, I, there's been some nights where I'm just like, screw it. Why not? I don't gotta go anywhere in the morning. Why not? You know. Minoru says, "I am one who lived in the distant past, in the age of Hyrule's founding." I love it. Circumstances forced me to forsake my body and became a being of pure spirit. Long have I slumbered within Zelda's. I, I said Pura Pad the whole game, but apparently it's Pura Pad in order to share what I knew when it passed to your hands. I apologize that our meeting has been so long delayed. The Demon King's interference is to blame. Nevertheless, I ask your pardon. Well then. Now, onto the topic at hand. In my own age, the distant past, from your perspective, Zelda awakened as a sage of time and appeared before us. What I must relate to you is a tragedy that occurred in Hyrule's history. At its crux was Zelda, who held a secret stone and traversed time. 
Uh -huh. She made a momentous decision in those days gone by. I would have you know of the, the resolve she poured into that blade, the Master Sword. Long ago, my people, known as the Zonai, came down from the heavens to the surface of the world. Cool. It was said they were descendants of gods. They bore treasures from these same gods, secret stones capable of amplifying the abilities of those who possessed them. Using the knowledge of the Zonai, my younger brother Rahu became a great leader. He met a young woman named Sonia, and they would wed. Rahu gifted Sonia one of the secret stones. Together, they sought to establish their kingdom. So cute. This is how the kingdom of Hyrule, with Rahu and Sonia as its first king and queen, came to be. The future looked bright. However, tragedy suddenly struck. A man of great evil emerged from the desert. The leader of the Gerudo, Ganondorf, killed Queen Sonya and stole her secret stone. Using the secret stone, Ganondorf transformed into the Demon King. Yep. He then created swarms of monsters and attacked. Or if you could get this cutscene without doing the tears. Hyrule rose up to face these threats, but the evil power driving the monsters forward was staggering. The defenders were on the brink of defeat. Raru then came up with a plan to turn the tide of the war. This is like the sixth time we've heard this. He entrusted secret <laughs> stones to warriors with exceptional abilities. They became sages and united in an effort to finally like, defeat the Demon cool. King. Like, this is cool. Is a cooler presentation. Raru and the sages outnumbered the Demon King and should have been able to stop him. However... Don't show the me that Demon same King's scene again. The power had grown far beyond anything we could have imagined. Oh, okay, it's different. It's different. It's different. I was unable to withstand his strength. No. Oh my Our god. Fight appeared all but lost. And then wrong. himself to one final act. Oh my god. Oh my now, Raru. That pride will be your downfall, Ganondorf. So sick with the bell, the bell chime in the background. God dang! Finally, we see the the cool stuff. <gasps> Hell yeah! He put the stone in his heart. Don't be so smug. I know exactly what it will cost me. His arm. <laughs> that's how his arm. Dude, that's so that's badass. Pass on the brink of an eye. You will delay the inevitable. You're wrong. Years from now, someone will appear with the sword that seals the darkness. A swordsman with the power to defeat you, Link. Oh! Remember this name. <laughs> I got chills. Interesting. I look forward to meeting you. Oh my god, the music.
Dude. That cutscene was... I, I, I honestly think that's my favorite. That was so cool. Wow. Remember this name. That, that, that gave me chills, dude. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Dude, that gave me chills. Jesus. Fexy, thank you for the raid. Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, my goodness, dude. The ends of the ominous tone. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Clive said, I have something to confess. I got a better offer for my career. My original plan was to straight start right after notice is served, but then FF16 is so good, so I decided to take one more one month before in between. Dude, so wait, you're saying you like you, you you're like you're like hey let's 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 just let's let it have a month that way uh, I can play some FF16. Hell yeah, dude, that's awesome. Uh, <laughs> that's awesome. Dude, this is so cool chat as well. Oh my god. Yeah, the original Zelda theme was that in the background? Yeah, I thought so. Though it took all we were able to give, we succeeded in, the imprisoning, in imprisoning the Demon King. But I was wounded in the process. My body was soon to expire. Well then. You can, you can say the word die, you know. That is when Zelda came to me, bearing a decayed and broken sword. Yes, you'll recall the Master Sword vanished from your hand at the Temple of Time. From there, it traveled into the distant past, appearing in Zelda's hands. You now... And now you hold it once again. Are they going to explain what happened to Zelda now? Oh god. You're saying that sword traveled through time the same way you did? Yes. But more importantly, in my original time, the Demon King was vulnerable to even the smallest piece of this sword. Even someone... Like him has vulnerabilities. Hmm. Then, what exactly are you suggesting we do with the sword? This must be the scene that was like but hidden. The time, that we had. The master sword is able to absorb sacred power. It can heal itself and even grow stronger. Curious. If we were able to empower it in that way, it could be the key to defeating the Demon King. But it could take centuries for that sword to grow strong enough. The power the Demon King wields. I do not see how this can be done. It would be impossible for you to provide it with sacred power for so long. I can think of one way. You mean? Yes, I can do it. I have to. I've told you, that act is forbidden. For a very good reason. Man. It would mean throwing yourself away. <laughs> oh, Maru. <sighs> you won't be able to change back. Oh, there's gotta be a way. No, please, no. The moment I had the sword, I knew what to do. I knew this was why I came to this era. to restore the master sword and deliver it to Link. I understand. You really have made up your mind? Very well then. As a Zonai, I bear my share of blame for these events. So I too will devote myself to this goal and to this hero of yours. For the Swordsman Link, I will do everything I can. Even if my body should perish, I will still be with you in spirit. Chat. Afterwards, Zell and I discussed strategy. We laid the groundwork for guiding you in the distant future. Well then. Before the gloom's affliction took my life, I became a spirit and entered the pure pad. Then Zella did what she felt she must and began the forbidden process. She believed you would use the Master Sword to defeat the Demon King and restore peace to Hyrule. Aha. 
you already have in hand the hope that Zelda left to you. The sword that seals the darkness, the Master Sword. Well then. Go now, Link. The sword of hope that Zelda left to you, you will surely smite Demon King Ganondorf. Wow, you can actually use the construct at any time. That's awesome. Trail of the Master Sword. Complete. Wait, you're telling me... Oh, I wonder if... I wonder if you didn't have the Master Sword yet. If she would have gave you a hint on where to find it. That's probably what, have, what would have happened, right? Because it, it just popped up new quests and then it said completed at the same time. This is so interesting. It sort of creates an issue though because Gandalf was already sealed before Zelda and Link found him. And Raru hand in the present. Right before Zelda was transported from the present to the past. But it's just a paradox, right? It's like a, it's just a bootstrap paradox, essentially. Right? Like they're doing it they're doing it the way where where the it's it's in a loop forever, right? That's why I assume. I, I like like there's no Zelda is there in the past seeing the imprisonment. Uh and she was always there in the past. That's 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 kind of how I interpret it. It's like she always did that in in the timeline. I need more materials. I've been tasked by Minoru with gathering materials from the depths. Okay. Oh, ancient blade. Oh my. God. It's fifty damage. Jesus. Oh my God. One such material is zonite. I can offer you one ancient blade for every 50 pieces of zonite you supply. Ooh, should I get another one? Worth chat or no? Might not be worth it because I might want to use that zonite for batteries, right? I'm going to say no thanks right now. That's a lot though. Ancient blades been below. I'm ready to produce. Oh, what the heck? You can buy stuff with Zonite. Also, that's here's the kingdom symbol. Is it or Ouroboros? Ouroboros? It's like the loop, right? Yeah. Calamity again happened because the seal started to weaken again and its power leaked out over time. That makes sense. It really seems like Breath of the Wild was just kind of like, uh, hey, this is a prototype for what you're going to actually do in tears, you know? It really feels like that. Um... Anything else I can do here? Yes. Aha. Uh -huh. Well then. Okay. So what do we got? It's twelve thirty. Oh my god. Ancient blades below. I cannot believe I have. Like, look at that freaking. That's crazy. It's like literally the highest attack power. Uh, let's go to main quest. Let, wait, let's also see if it... if Is Minoru... Is the scene with Minoru in here? It is! Okay, there, there it is. I knew it would replace that. Nice. We've literally done everything. Um, okay. Find the fifth sage. 
Report to Pura, okay. All right, I guess we report to Pura. I don't really know what else to do. Yeah. Let's go, chat. Question is, where's Ganon gonna be, you know? Like, I don't... I don't understand where we're gonna go. Like, we already went to the castle, and he's not there anymore. And I don't think they'll just make you go back to the castle. Maybe they will? I, I don't... I honestly don't know. <laughs> but... I'm not sure. I don't know. <sighs> Time travel is messy. I think I solidified the story as much as they could have. I'll, I'll give more... I, I want to be very careful, like, looking at what you guys are saying. I love you guys, but I just don't want to... I want to wait till I'm fully done and get credits rolled, you know? And then I'll, I'll give my thoughts on it. But so far, I think it's fine. I don't think there's anything wrong with how they're doing it right now. All right, let's talk. Let's also save. No spoilers to older Zelda games? Uh... I don't know. I've never played any of them. It depends if you guys want me to play those games at some point. I don't know. Did you find anything about out about the fifth stage? Yes, we did. What? You found the Sage of Spirits? Minoru? This is uh -huh. incredible. That means we have the five sages. Fantastic work, Link. I can't believe this is actually one of the sages who faced off against the Demon King alongside Princess Zelda. And now we have news about the princess. There's some relief in that. Uh -huh. So, Princess Zelda worked to restore the decayed Master Sword and return it to your hand, trusting that you would defeat the Demon King in the present day. She did so much all on her own. What? The Master Sword was restored, you say? When were you planning on telling me? Yeah, thanks, Link. And it was found on the head of a white dragon of all places? That's hard to believe. However, hmm. that was Princess. this was Princess Zelda's wish, one she believed in so strongly that she gave her life to see it through for us. Thank you for finding the sword, Link. I have to say, <laughs> you really don't look quite yourself unless you've got the Master Sword at your side. Check it. Now then, it seems you have all you need. You've, you're prepared to face our enemy. Okay. It's gotta be the final quest. Oh my god, oh my god, everything's completing. Hmm. We need to determine where the Demon King is lurking. It seems unlikely he'd still be in the castle. That must mean... Huh? Oh, no. I didn't think about that. Oh, no. Well, you wouldn't say there's a high probability that he's... Wouldn't you say there's a high probability that he's in the depths? Mm -hmm. Do what you think best, of course, but my suggestion is to ask Joshua for any info she may have. She's enth enthusiastic about investigating the depths, so I'm sure she'd be happy to help out. Yeah. The rest is up to you. Destroy Ganondorf. Oh, my God. Holy... Jesus. <laughs> Hi, Swordsman. Um, what about them? Mm -hmm. You know the chasm in the force of time south of Hyrule Field? Well, another series of statues were discovered at the bottom of it. These statues are different than the one you showed me. They seem to point the way somewhere, too, and you do come and do come near where you got your auto build ability. But they don't stop there. These statues lead farther southwest into the depths. Where they go is anyone's guess, but I bet there's a destination far beyond that building worth seeing. <laughs> At this point, the chasms and the statues are points of focus for the investigation. Okay. Oh. What? Yeah. Mm -hmm. The chasm in the forest of time south of Hyrule Field. Okay. It's weird. This is for a different quest. It is? Gotta hit the hay, but we'll have to catch yeah. another more. Best of luck. Thank you, Lucky Dragon. Thank you. I hope you have a good night's sleep. It's for a different... Here's a po. Here's a po for you. Oh. 
Thank you. Thank you for the dark clump. What the hell just happened? What's this guy doing? The dark trousers. Oh, I can get dark trousers now? Hell yeah. Heck yeah, man. Dark tunic and dark trousers. Let's go, baby. Um, what the heck? They look normal at first. Dark pants. I'm going to get them. Why not? Sure. Give me one of the locations. Dude, he's just giving me locations. Cool. Um. Wind, fire, water, lightning, and spirit. The five stages of awakening and entrusted you with their power. You still don't know where Demon King Gandorf is, but Pure says she suspects the depths. If you work with Joshua, who's been investigating the depths, you might gain a lead. So, I need to go where Josh is saying at the Temple of Time? Follow jump scare. What's up, Wee What? Hey. I'm so confused right now. Josh really said, yo, go, to, go over here. This is quite a long quest. What? I'm so confused then. They just gave me something else to do? I'll cook some food really fast. things really fast. Gloom resistance, baby. Let's go. Do more gloom resistance. Oh, three minutes. Let's do... Let's do I got. Truffle. I'm just, I'm just cook, uh, keep cooking truffles. These were like really good to cook. Just give you that full, re full recovery. Can I get four extra hearts of this? Heck yeah. Um. Yeah, dude. Um. Boom. All right, that's some good food. All right. The Joshua quest is long. But, but, like, clearly they're telling me this is what I should do. Like, the game is going, yo, work with Joshua. Uh -huh. huh. The chasm in the force of time south of Hyrule Field. Force of time. Hmm. <laughs> oh. Hyrule Field. Where's the forest of time? Right here? 
This one? Are you talking about this one? Yeah, it's this one. Have I done this? Let's go here. That was the first chasm I went to. All right, I, I'm just gonna go look very fast. And, cause I, it, it feels weird that the game is pointing me in that direction. So I'll go here for a second. She's saying there's another set. It's so wild. Oh. Nice. Yo, it's so cool. I love it. It's so badass that we can do this now. Oh, I still have all my parts. They saved the parts that you had last time. Yeah, I got auto build. Yeah. Will you be streaming Nintendo Direct? Uh, if I somehow wake up, maybe, but most likely not. Just because I feel like I'm going to be so tired from tonight, you know? I'm not entirely sure, but I just feel like I'm going to be tired. I'm going to need my rest for, for everything we're about to do. You fall down here. Where's... Oh, it's that statue right there. It's this statue. Pointing this way. Well, we're finding some sort of path. I see the statues, chat. Going, we're going somewhere. Statue here. Chad, I just gotta say, I appreciate you guys being here. I know it's late. I know these streams have been very late every night, but it's been very fun, and I, I just really appreciate it, okay? Thank you. Thank you for always being here. It's been, it's been really fun. This entire playthrough has been really fun. Um, I'll keep going this way. Yeah. yeah there's a statue there. I think I see another one over here. Chat, am I following the right statues at least of what Joshua said? I am, right? I appreciate you, JC. Thank you. I appreciate y'all too. Thank you. JC will be here although I'm drunk, so I've been quiet. <laughs> I hope you're all good. Oh man, I hope I hope you're you're drinking safely. Yeah. Stay safe out there. Where is this? Is this still a statue? Oh my god, this one's just like turning to the right. It's not this, right? Whoa, what? There's a quest I can toggle? Wait, really? I don't... I don't know if there is. Maybe, maybe there is? Side adventure. It's not here, dude. It's the Master Koga quest. What? How's that related to what Joshua said? Then? Holy 
these statues, dude. What? You found him by falling statues, then he flew away once you beat him. Yeah. But but they said these are a different set of statues. Like, did the statues reset? Is that what happened? I'm so intrigued. I'm like, wait, what? <laughs> They're truly t taking me on a journey right now. That's for sure. Love having max stamina though, it's so nice. Oh, hello. Oh, I'll put this to use. Hey. You've been streaming like crazy lately. Thanks for all you do. Thank you so much, WDH. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That really means a lot. Oh. You're too kind. Thank you for the ten dollars, dude. What the heck? I I'm I'm I've been addicted to streaming. It's been fun. It's been fun. Oh my gosh. What the I used to be an adventurer like you. Then I took an arrow in the knee. What the hell? What is going on, dude? Bye bye. <laughs> What? <laughs> um, damn, you really, you really died to that. Okay. God dang it. Oh, WD, thank you so much again. I appreciate it. Chat, 07 is the chat. 10 bucks is a lot, man. That's a lot of money at this hour of night. And it goes directly to me as well. It's not even, Twitch doesn't even take any of that. So I do, I appreciate it. I... I'm glad, I'm glad you guys have been enjoying the streams. What the hell is that? What? They can fly vehicles on their own? That's crazy. Is that a car? Oh, okay. <laughs> it's like a camp. What in the world, dude? Bro, I'm so confused. I, I gotta find a statue again. I'm just gonna go towards... Should I just go towards the yellow? Like, honestly? Is that where I should go, chat? To be honest, there's a light route there, though. Oh, grab this light route real fast. At least we're getting more of the depths finally unlocked. That's nice. I better fast travel to a chasm closer. That, that's not a bad idea. Go like maybe here or something. I like that idea. Let's do that. Nintendo stretch this ending so much. Yeah, I don't, I, I'm kind of like, what's going on right now with the pacing? It's like, yo, you get this sick, like Titanfall construct companion and the game goes, all right. Like what? <laughs> like, like the time for solving things is over. Like, we need, we need to finish the game. 
this quest is supposed to be done early game. But that's the thing, though, right? Is like, this game's all about doing things at your own pace. So I had no idea that I was supposed to do it. I had no idea I was supposed to do this quest. Like, how was I supposed to know? Oh my god, it's freezing. You can end the game right now, but chat's gonna have to tell you. No! I mean, my guess... Let, 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 me, let me go do this one first. Let's see if I learn anything from this one marker, and then we'll we'll see. Because I bet if it's something where we have to fight this guy like three times. How did Noah J beat this game in like three streams, chat? Like, I need to understand how he did that. Like, that's honestly insane. Mother of God, where am, where am I? Whoa. Bro, I thought those were eyes, dude. I was like, what is that? Dude, where, where the hell? Oh my god, where am I? Let me go grab one of these light roots, but jeez, dude. I'll go this way because I Got any big bright blooms? I think I do, but where are they? There they are. Ah, it's much better. Oh, one heart gone. Yeah, the the light roots. Yeah, dude, I was somebody that I discovered that that light root. The light roots are connected to the shrines like so early on. I don't know what it was, but like I just put two and two together so quickly. And everybody was like, "Oh wow, you figured that out?" I was like, "Yeah." And then chat told me about the name being backward thing. That was cool. Oh, true. You can use mineral. I keep forgetting about that. Hold on. Let me grab this. Let's grab this. Get more of the depths. Unlocked. That is not that much unlocked. What the heck? How do you guys feel about the depths? Now there's been more time playing this game, by the way. Like, how do you guys feel about it? Do you think it's a really good addition? Let's see what's in this chest. Miner's mask. Whoa, that looked creepy. It's like antlers or something, dude. What the heck? Oh my god. What? Yo, Construct. Yo, Ladder, you alive? Can you build some stuff for me? I'm a forge. Please process my Zonite. There are materials that have been processed from the ore. I'm willing to accept Zonite in exchange for process material. Yes. Yes. Okay, okay. I want these. I want these big boy charges. I want them all. Give them all to me. Take them all. 
That way I can get a battery. Let's go. Okay. Of them, I, I, I think about the depths is that they're close to tie your battery, which means you need to spend time here to upgrade it. For all for all the, the Zonite stuff, yeah. I kind of wish there was more sky than depths. Yeah, I could see that too. I'm kind of with you on that. I, I think I like the sky a lot more. Love them. I'd be upset you didn't explore them. So there's so much, but it is what it is. You can even find iconic weapons for passing the desert. Cool. I doubt you'll find one though. Um, I, I mean, I got like... So I did find this, right? I did find this. I got like... Link's like... Classic tunic. Which I thought was pretty cool, right? That's kind of what you're talking about. I think I think the thing is is that um where's Minoru? There you are. Um the thing with with the depths though is I I I thought I thought that was a thing, right? I was like, oh, every single X is gonna be a classic outfit or something. Like that's what I assumed, because the first thing I got was this tunic. And I was like, oh my god, what? That's so cool. And then I like found another one and it was like some glowy vest, and I was like it's not that cool. Um, and so then I just, I don't know, I didn't do it as much after that. Um, so, I don't know, like, I, this playthrough has, I haven't been here a ton, but I but I also feel like, man, I, I just don't know which ones are, which are best to go to. And I haven't had a reason to go to the depths quite yet. There hasn't been too many quests where I've been like, oh yeah, I need to go down there. And there hasn't been a lot of, like, main quest stuff down here. And I think that's the other issue. Um, but, yeah, I know what you mean. I haven't done it a ton on this playthrough. I imagine some people probably were down here for ages. But, I don't know. It's just, it's really cool. But, I think that... Um, where's Menaru? I think it's really cool, but if you had to, like, tell me, okay, what's better? Like, this or the, um, the Elden Ring Underground? I'd be like, the Elden, the Elden Ring Underground, 100%. Like, the way that that place looked, the things that you could find were, like, the the bosses, the side quest with, uh, what is it, the witch, the blue, the blue, the blue girl, like, her whole, like, in-game quest that you can do when you go into that, like, oh, god, it's so just unreal, the stuff that happens in those areas, and also, like, the stars in the sky look really cool, yeah, Ronnie, I forgot her name, um, but yeah, I, ju I just feel like, I feel like I enjoy that a bit more. Like, I I think after a bit, having to throw a Bright Bloom seed nonstop kind of gets old. Um, it was really cool at the beginning, but I'm like, I don't, I don't really want to do that too much now. Like, I, I feel like we've been there, done that, you know. Abandoned Gerudo mine. Hey, yo. Who's shooting me? Who the hell? Oh my god. I want to see if I can... Can I Master Chief this and board it? That'd be awesome. Oh, come on. Alright, Minoru, help me out. What the heck? Screw this. I'm just gonna go this way. I, I. Is this the guy? Oh, here he is. It's right hand, right? So why isn't this working? 
back there. Take over for a while. I think I realize it's me. <laughs> it's you again. You just had to follow me here, didn't you? I'm doing what you did exactly, but it refuses to work. You tricked me. I won't stand for this. But no more. I'll battle you, I'll beat you, and I'll steal that power back from you. Prepare yourself. Always oh, spawning over there. He's got light. Oh, why can't I ascend? There we go. Master Sword, baby, let's go. He's got a shield now. Ow! Use key eyeballs. Oh, not a bad idea. Let's do it. Where is it? Where's the eyeball? Thank you. <laughs> Master Sword is tearing right now. This place has too much sand. I'm not gonna let you get off easy again. We've been collecting a mighty power source scattered all across this land. Crystallized charges. Okay. We're going to use them to restore an unstoppable weapon for the man himself. The Magnificent One. Once we do, we'll grant his wish for the end of the world. So we don't need the power you stole. Our collection of crystallized charges is well underway. And the restoration of the final weapon is close at hand. We've already stripped all the resources here. If you want this empty shell, you can have it. I'm going to be swimming in crystals at the eastern abandoned mine. Bro, this guy... This guy. Now away I fly. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what the heck, dude? What is this? Greetings. Thank you for driving out the trespassers. The abandoned Lenaru mine. Okay. Oh, cool, we get another schema stone. Nice. Let's grab this. Oh my god. Wow, you get batteries for doing this. That's awesome. Okay, this quest is cool, though. This quest is cool. You actually get some good stuff from doing this. Like, 100 crystal charges is sick. Okay. What'd you give me? Hovercraft, nice. Awesome. Very, very cool. Okay. Hovercraft. That's so badass. Oh my god, that's so sick. It has a light on the end of it, too. Heck yeah. Well, we go for this X over here, chat, if we want to really fast. Why am I doing it? We gotta, we gotta beat the game. 
What are we doing? Bro. Enough is enough. Yeah, this thing is not hovering. What is this? This is definitely also an X, I bet. I don't know why. Maybe it isn't. I don't know. We'll see. Oh my god. Okay. Where's the... Let me put a pen right there. Yeah. Take me home, baby. Take me home. I need to know. I need to know what one more of the X's is. We need to do it. Get a chest after every blueprint. Throw a bright bloom on your vehicle. Oh, that's actually a great idea. Oh God. <laughs> that's a great idea. That was so smart. Look at that. We can see. Yeah. Oh God, they can see me though. Screw this. Not wasting my time right now. How much further. Oh my god. Okay. I'm just gonna say this. I, my guess of where Ganon is. All right, shot in the dark for the finale, all right? Because we got to figure this out. Here's my, here's my guess. All right, you ready for this, chat? You ready? All right. You ready? Underneath the castle. All the way down. That's my guess. My guess is if I just run there. I will probably find him. Where else would they put him? Like, where else? I would just... I don't want y'all to confirm or deny. That's my guess. I honestly might just go there. And just see what happens. Um, also, somebody said something about Elden Ring in the chat. I wanted to read it. It was earlier. Oh, it was Flash. Flash said... I have 550 hours in Elden Ring, but for me, I prefer the depths in this game. Wait, really? Just simply because I love how much there is to explore, plus finding things like Majora's Mask felt so much more rewarding in this game. I mean, yeah, that's that's true. Like getting like cool like old weapons. Like for some of you guys, like I never played those games, so I don't I don't know. But like stuff like that does sound really sick. But I I don't know. I I just like how in Elden Ring like there's no tell. Like there were so there's so many different things. Like there was boss fights. There was full-on uh, quests that gave you an extra ending that you'd have to do stuff down there. There was, like... It was just really pretty as well. I loved how pretty it was. Um, also, the... Uh, I don't know. Like, I... I feel like... Just for me, I enjoyed it more. But, but then again, I haven't, I haven't explored this like crazy yet, so... So I do not know why... It says there's an X here. But how do I get in? There are a lot. There are a lot of boss fights down here. That is cool. That is very cool. Um. Dude, what?
Guys, am I going insane? Oh, here we go. There it is. Do I have to fight multiple? What the hell is this, dude? waves, dude. What? be it, right? There's one more. Oh, my God. My God, there's more. Holy hell, 32 attack power. We actually got it. Master Sword's about to die. Oh, we got it. Dude, that better have been a sick reward. That was a lot of fighting. That was... That was a lot of fighting, man. Oh my goodness. Give me something good. <gasps> no way! I know that from Smash Chat. I've never played what this is from, but I know this from Smash Bros. What the heck? A mask said to have been, to have been worn by a Sheikah who saved a time-traveling hero. Made from the finest of Sheikah stealth fabrics. It is the final word in undercover gear. 
That's ocarina. Dude, that's badass. Yo, that's sick. What? Hold up. Let's look at let's look at this. Bro, look at this. Hold on, hold on. I need to get my let's do my normal my normal drip. Oh yeah. Oh dude. <laughs> oh what? Okay, that was totally worth it. That was really cool. That's such a cool like armor. Oh my god. I love it. See, I, that that makes it more worth it for sure, chat. For sure. Definitely, definitely. Okay, so they're saying to go this way for the Okay, hold on. Let me really quickly. Let me go back to lookout landing and get more batteries. Oh my god, we still have over 100 people. Over 100 people. Let's get some more batteries. And then I don't know. I'll debate what to do next. Yeah, maybe some more arrows. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're really we're we're losing a lot of our arrows today. We need to get some more. I was thinking about that too, yeah. They have arrows that look at landing, right? I'm pretty sure they do. It'd be nice to get a couple of them. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Bum, bum, ba -dum, ba -bum. <laughs> Keep producing. Heck yeah. Let's go, chat. That's way better now. If we got this. Two energy wells. I'll take that. That's way better. Hey, what's up, Chris? Hello? And let's get some arrows. Hopefully they have someone here to do that. I wonder if Joshua will say anything different. Hey, Joshua, you want to help me out? Listen to this. I received new info about the depths. Yeah. We discovered more statues in Lunaru to the east. Oh my gosh. Hmm. Oh. Oh. Okay. Yeah, they really want you to do this quest. Wow. I missed out on this. Um, where's the shop over here? Where's the shop at? Here we go. Here's some arrows. Yeah, give me all ah. these. Literally all of them. Oh. I have 27 now. It's not bad. Chat, up to you guys. What do you think? Do you think I should I should finish this this thing that I'm doing? Or what? What do y'all think I should do? I'll travel here while we're thinking. Let me tell you how many times you need to fight him. Bro, I'm... If it's like literally five times, I'm going to be like, oh my god. I'd imagine there's four. That's my guess. This game's been doing four a bunch. I, I imagine I'm halfway done. I could be wrong. Could be wrong. Could be wrong. Let's see. Ball. Uh. Where am I going? I want to go there. That's right. I'll say this. Give me the green light. Can you tell me this? Am I. Will I be. Am I over halfway done? Tell me that. Over? No. Okay. There's a 
hidden chasm in Zora's domain. Wait, really? There is? There is? Let me get, the, let me get this light root, though. Hold on. I think Joshua said that, but I just did not listen to Joshua. Dude, why are there like so many enemies here? What? Excuse me. It's like so directly the objective is. Yo, please. Okay. Bye bye. <laughs> I might do this one and then see if, if I can figure out where Ganon is. I I just don't know if I want to just... I feel like we're stalling the ending at this point. And it's like 1.30 a.m. Like, I want to just get to the ending. I want to get to it, chat. I want to get to it, man. It's behind a waterfall. Chat, which way? This waterfall? Or like, actually in here? By the bridge? Over here? Bridge. Big, 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 big bridge. This thing. Wow, this is so cool. Whoa, that's so sick. That's so cool. Like what? That's so awesome. Oh, it's like loading or something. If they all have a hidden one, we should just, we should just do that. Maybe we'll finish this quest, chat, because this chest does give you batteries, which is super nice. I don't know. We'll see. I'll just I'll speed run it. Speed run time. I don't have any X's here. God. It's a 
long way in the water. Put on my swimming gear. It's my swimming gear. There we go. Oh, it was in Rito. Got it. Yo, what's up? <laughs> Let's try it again. Anyway, angles off. <laughs> How long have you been there? I love this. Cowardly sneak. Killing time, bro. What the heck? <laughs> the end is nigh. I love the music in these fights. Oh, he's in a boat this time. Oh, my God. What can I use to absolutely destroy this guy? Huge damage. Wow, I'll, ta I'll take your boat, I guess. <laughs> Bonobo, help me. Oh. <laughs> I'll take your boat again. Bonobo. Yonobo is literally a god. Yonobo! <laughs> Go, Yonobo! <laughs> stick got wet dude i hate when that happens they've located the man himself they found the demon king just one more step one teeny little step until the yiga clan clan's uh long standing desire comes to fruition one more abandoned mine okay there's only one more so i'm gonna start the final excavation the northwestern abandoned mine awaits that's why i use those charges to activate our ultimate weapon offered to the demon king and bring the world to its end Wait, I wonder, I wonder if, is he in the Northwest? That's kind of cool. What if we don't end up at the castle? That'd be interesting, whoa. That'd be, dude, if, if Gandorf's in the Northwest, that's crazy. Oh, oh, hello. Yay, yay, yay. Give me some some batteries. Dude, that's so cool you get a battery for doing this. I wish I would have known that earlier. Like, I just, I never knew. Never knew. Never knew this quest gave me batteries. I did not catch that for some reason. What are you going to give me? What, what is this? 
Bolt Boat. That's cute. Bolt Boat. Bolt Boat. Bolt Boat. Um, anyways. Don't know if I... Let me use this quite yet. I think I, think I want to go to the next object objective, which is over here. Which I imagine there's a secret chasm... Somewhere right close by. I, I'm guessing there's a cave underneath the Rito. Chat, am I correct? Is there a cave underneath the Rito? That's my guess. There's a there's a cave underneath there, and then that's it. There is? Heck yeah, dude. It's gotta be close. So I bet it's like the middle island right there, like to the right. Something like that. Let me buy more arrows though. Dude, this is the Korok. <laughs> I can't believe that Korok's still been there for that long. It's like, dude, you can you can do something else, man. Oh my god. That's so funny, dude. Alright, where's do we have any arrows? Any arrows? There's gotta be a shop, right? Is it the is it the pot icon on my map? No. Maybe it is. Any arrows? Yes. I'll buy them all. Yes. Got 41 now. That's not bad. Do honestly, let me get a night's rest. Silky soft. Let's do it. Wake up in the morning. Silky soft bed, please. Use all of our money. <laughs> wow. Wow. That's amazing. I better get some hearts from that. Oh my god. What the hell? You can have a nightmare? That's terrifying. Ah. That's absolutely terrifying, chat. I skipped it. Was it a different? I I didn't know if it was different. I thought it was the same. No. I thought it was the same. Rip. I imagine it's a cave really close in here somewhere. Chat, tell me where it is. I don't mind if you guys tell me. Is it? It's gotta be like on one of these rocks, right? Objective's there. Middle island near the shrine? Wait, really? It's near the shrine? I'm gonna teleport again. What? Okay. Alright. It's on the south side of the island. Okay. Okay. Is it like that little crevice, maybe? Hmm. That Korok, my favorite, my favorite Korok right there. That's my boy. Is it this? No shot. What was the hello there? Hold on. Ah. Ah. That's so cool. Oh. 
That's so freaking cool. I love the secret chasms. Like, I wish I would have found these earlier in the game. That would have been nice. Let's get the bright boom. Hey, we're getting more of the depths today, chat. We are. We are. There's two X's on this one. This mine's only accessible? Wow, that's sick. <laughs> only accessible through that. Is the lad here? Where is he? Oh, he's just chilling over here. <laughs> he's slumped. Oh, he's praying. What's he doing? We just fight Gandorf here and win the game. Like, it's just here. No way. No way Ganon's here. Mm. I've been waiting for you. It is done. We have enough crystallized charges at last. What? Mm. And now, our gift to the Demon King. A weapon beyond compare. will be reborn. Today we'll go down Where's infamy. Where's going? Bingo? As the day of our ultimate weapons resurrection and the day the world face its end. We'll hold this feat of engineering. I'll laugh so hard if it's just like a cube. Okay, it's not. Oh, it's good. Oh. In the darkness below the castle where the Demon King now dwells. <laughs> I knew it, chat. Yes, where the end of all things will begin. In the deepest reaches of the depths far beneath Hyrule Castle. Oh my. Yo, wrestle match? Rematch? This time I'll bury you. Damn, that goes hard. Hey, Minoru, where you at? Let's go. One more hit. Where's he at? Oh, I see. You gotta knock him out of this. This is sick, dude. Whoa, I definitely dodged that, but okay. Let's use some crazy weapons. Master Sword? Let's use, let's use this. 46. This is a cool fight, chat. Like, oh! All right, let's use electricity. Thank 
god for Minoru. Oh! Dude. <laughs> got him. Let's go, chat. Dude, he actually got destroyed. My beautiful weapon. I love these, like, ring boss fights. These are sick. All my work destroyed. Damn. You little twerp. I was this close to destroying the world with the Demon King. You think I'm just gonna let this stand, do you? What? Time to bust out my serious moves. A brand new technique I came up with in the deepest darkness of the darkest depths. It will destroy you. What? Me. What? <laughs> Tremble in fear before my unstoppable rocket. This is the end. Uh oh. <laughs> no! I'll have my revenge! He just goes to space? <laughs> what? Oh my god. Nice, dude. Team Rocket blasting off again. Oh. Greetings. I'll come to you. Please wait a moment. Oh my god. Mine's similar to this one can be found in the thriving surface settlements and other places of distinction. There appear to be some connection between the surface and the depths. Very curious. Uh, another schema? Yeah. Nice. I hope we get two batteries out of that. That would be awesome. That'd be very sick. Oh, no. Come on, Nintendo. Come on, Nintendo. Give me two. Not diamond. I want diamond. No. I saw two chests. I was so excited to get two batteries. Oh. I want diamonds. I'm not playing Minecraft. Okay, what's the schema? Rocket platform. Aw. Cute. Very, very cute. Very, very cute. Well, chat? I think... With that... Fly. I wanna fly high. Oh wow, this just led me to a chest. Okay. Take that, I guess. Oh, only 20? Only 20? Okay, fine. I wanna fly high. Somebody will be. Refiner, should I do that really fast? <laughs> Give me Zonite. Let me process Zonite. Give me. I'll 
I'll take them all. I don't have enough. I will have I literally do not have enough. Rip. Um All right, let's go get our battery. So here are two batteries and then it's time, chat. It's time. I think we're finally here. I mean, what else is there? I mean, we know now it's underneath the castle, so I assume we just go there, you know? I assume. What else do we do? We can talk to Joshua really fast, see if Josh has any other clue, but I assume we just somehow go underneath the castle. All that to find out the obvious. Yeah, true, true. I knew it as well. It's like, that would make sense. That would make sense, you know? Look at these batteries. Heck yeah. Dude, I wish I knew about this quest 10 hours ago, chat. Or actually like 30 hours ago in the playthrough. That would have been nice to have all these batteries. That's for damn sure. That would have been very nice. Wow, there's still, it's still not even maxed out. Like it's only halfway. God dang. All right, Joshua, what do you got for us? You look, you're in a good mood. Did you discover something? Yep. Oh. You defeated Kaga? Well, of course you did. You're a swordsman. Okay. Uh -huh. Nothing, huh? Well, even so, that's one less danger for the princess. I'm not surprised you did all this. You're the swordsman. Oh. Okay. Can I come back to you now? Oh. There's got to be a connection between Princess Elle and the Depths. <laughs> Okay, I assume that it's basically we we doing that quest actually is what tells us what to do. So I guess on our own, we have to go underneath the castle now. I'm going to buy more arrows again, chat. I'm going to buy them all. I'm going to clean them out. Oh, I got 64. That should be enough. We should honestly buy some food. Some fish would be good, maybe. Buy some cheese, you know. Ah. Let's cook some stuff. One last time. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. Where's my where's my stuff? That's, that works as well. <laughs> Mushroom cheese. Can't carry more meals. What? Really? Bro. What? Or maybe maybe we're fine. Chat, maybe we'll be okay. Might be cutting close, but I'll say this. I on my sword, my master sword that I got back. Let's do this, guys. Let's take out this. I say we put ancient blade on the master sword, and that's the final that's the final blows to Ganon. That's what I'm thinking. We put Ancient Blade on the damn Master Sword. What do you think? It's going to be insane damage. Insane damage. Like, drop that on the ground right there. I never try on a sword. 
It's gotta be sick, right? They're pretty fragile. Wait, really? Really? Wait, let me go to my... Oh, can we use this as an arrowhead? Oh... Okay, hold on. Silver Moblin Horn. I say we use Silver Moblin Horn then. If it's 33 attack power. So we're, we're gonna have to do something like that. That's huge. I'm doing it. <laughs> there we go. And then, let's keep going. Got this. Do something Zonai related to this? Wait, really? I always forget about that. Like this? Captain Construct horn then? It's 45. It's pretty damn good. Honestly, let's put another one of these. <laughs> All right. Feeling pretty good about this chat. Feeling pretty good. Hylian shield. We look kind of badass, I'm not gonna lie, dude. There we go. What's our plan of action? If it's underneath the castle, Hyrule Castle Chasm. I bet we just do that then. I assume. I'm gonna I'm gonna use this travel. And then really quickly chat, as I'm traveling, I'm gonna hit pause over here and go get some water. Because I'm gonna need it for whatever the hell is about to happen here. Oh my goodness. Okay. Save. All right, I'll be right back. Right back, chat. This is the end, get ready.
Okay. Oh my God. Okay. Guys, I got some veggie straws. Does everybody have their snacks? Is everybody ready? You got your coconut milk? Coconut water? That sounds really good. Okay. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready if you guys are ready. I'm very nervous, but I, I'm, I'm ready for this. This is it. This is it. All we know is that we have one goal. Destroy Ganon. And in doing so, find Princess Zelda, even though we technically already know where she is, but we, there's gotta be a way to bring her back. I refuse to believe Nintendo would let this happen. Remove the marker from the map. Where am I? World map. Remove this marker. It's bothering me. Get out of here. We know that Ganon is underneath the castle. And here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna put on my feather, just like I always do. We're gonna face him. We're not gonna wear a mask. It's gonna be us and him. If I can get up this cliff. <laughs> if I, if I, if I can get up this cliff. God dang it. Hold on. This is literally like Claptrap at the end of Borderlands 2. Stairs? No! I, I might die. This... This isn't looking good. Let's freaking go. One last Korok. You're the last Korok in this playthrough. I love you, lad. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, Rock. See you in the next one, homie. <laughs> All right, we have the Hylian shield. We have Ganon's old armor to taunt him. And we have our feather that we've had this basically the whole playthrough. It's time. We have the master sword with a giant thorn on it. And worse than that, we have the Demon King's Bow, but we're gonna use the Royal Guard's Bow. Now, where is the chasm? Where is it? Is it not here? go. We go underneath. Is it this? Oh my god. Okay, we have definitely been here before. Alright, I'm still gonna do the jump, because why not? Hold on. Let's go. Let's go, chat. It's time. But where? So we got this shrine. We did this shrine earlier. 
How many souls are here, man? You think it's a zombie's Easter egg? How many souls are here? Holy, dude. My god. I just saw you have all the miners set. I do. I do. What does that do when you have them all, by the way? What, what, what's that tier 2 upgrade? I'm curious. What is that? Oh god, is he just down here? These goalie footsteps. Oh, that's sick. What? All right, here we go, guys. Oh, God. Was this even open before? Like, why didn't I go down here last time? What's up, Michael? Hey, JC. Hope you're doing well. You too, man. You too. Thank you so much. We're literally at the ending of the game, by the way. You picked a swell time to join. Thank you so much, dude. I... Where do I, where do I go? Is there a way to go, do I go deeper? Do we go over here? Holy hell, there's a lot of these guys. The music. I'm gonna waste my arrows. Let's grab this. Yep, grab this chest right now. Royal bow. Let's grab it. Let's go though. I'm moving. I'm not sticking around. This doesn't seem right. Hold on, hold on. This has got to be right. Yep. Let's go. Holy hell, where are we, dude? Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, what the hell? Um, oh no. Oh my God. I didn't realize what, I, I passed it though. Am I good? save here. Let's do a save. I'm going in, chat. I'm going freaking in right now. Let's go, baby. That's right. That's right, dude. What the hell is that, dude? <laughs> I wanted to see if I can do it. No. Damn it, dude.
No fairies. No fairies, dude. Dude, the way you said it, it sounded like no maidens. Yo, no maidens. <laughs> oh, does it save my? Does it save the stuff that I had? I assume so. Oh my god. How do you do the flurry rush, chat? Damn it! Perfect dodge. Do you dodge backwards or... Oh my god. That many healing items, man. Dude. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. It said mount. It said mount. Dude, I'm getting swept. I'm literally getting swept right now. I'm I'm running out of weapons. I mounted. I don't... This is bad. This is really bad, dude. Come on, come on. <sighs> Chat. Oh my god. Oh my god. 40 fuse attack power. Oh my god. Oh my god. Arrows, arrows, arrows. Lionel hoof. Lionel hoof. Arrow attack power. What is this? What is this? Oh, oh, broadsword, savage Lionel boat, 32 times three. <gasps> oh my God. Best bow maybe in the game. This is cracked. Are you kidding me? Liam said, how long is it? Wait, what did Liam say? Is this the longest game of all time? How are you still playing? <laughs> Liam 
of this game is crazy, bro. It doesn't end. It never ends, bro. It never ends, man. It's crazy out here, dude. Oh my god. Um, I used all of my healing, which is kind of unfortunate. I feel like, oh, dude, I, I don't know. I, I don't know what I should do, chat. I don't know what I should fuse that to. Like, I could fuse it to the broadsword. Do you have a portable cooking pot? I do. But, yeah, let's drop it for a second. Um, we need some, some, something major. Major. Um... God. Uh, I don't think I have. I I don't think I have anything. Cook five bananas for a strength boost. <laughs> you only get one thing to cook though. It's so annoying. You make pizza with Tabitha wheat, holly, and tomato and cheese. I don't think I have a tomato. I think I'm out. I think I'm out of this. Um, we might be screwed. We might be screwed. I mean, I do still have a couple more meals. I have, I have one more full recovery. I have two full recoveries. That's not terrible. I might be okay, to be honest. Maybe one more gloom meal. Maybe we maybe put this some something like that in there. Cook this with some Bro, I don't know. Gloom gloom omelet. I wanna I wanna make a gloom omelet. That's what I want. Gloom omelet, baby. Hell yeah. Please don't be dubious. Hey, it actually works. What happens if I just do a bunch of eggs? Oh, shoot. My cooking pot. All right, that's not bad. Eggs. Eggs are actually sick. Uh, Sundalions. I think I... I have a couple of those. Yeah, I have, I have a good amount of the Sundalion stuff. I think I'm good on that. Um, all right. I think I'm fine. I think, honestly, I'm fine, chat. I think I'll live. The, the question is, what do I... I want to use that insane... Fuse, but, you know, maybe we won't we won't need it right away. You know? Maybe we find... If we find one more better weapon, we'll use it. I think it's... We should take out this 73, though. Should take out all these big weapons that we got. Bro, this is crazy right now. This is absolutely crazy. Chat, I love you guys. Thank y'all for helping me so much. We got 100 viewers still this late at night. You guys are absolutely amazing. Um, let me find where to go. It was the... It was this. It was this. That's so cool. I'm so glad I, I fought one in the playthrough. You know? Like, I could have run... I could have ran past it. But I think it's good that we fought it. I think it was, you know, it felt good that we didn't just skip. All right, we're good. Good on that. Like there could have been a secret potential. Whoa. All right. Oh my God, where do we go, dude? We go this way. What? Go this way. Woo! You gonna react to Nintendo Direct? I'm not sure. It depends how late I stay up from this. But we're in the final stretch now. I just woke up. 
Love you. Appreciate you. Appreciate you guys. Um, I'm gonna. Let's go. Let's go out. Whoa! What just happened to me? Why am I losing hearts? Was I standing on stuff? Damn it! This is definitely the way to go. I think. Climb that. <laughs> Don't know where I am. Is this not correct? Oh, we gotta go that way. How the f Uh-oh. Um. <gasps> no, dude. Do I have the gloom shirt? I think I do. Yes, I do. I do. Let's put it on. I do have the gloom shirt. I do. Also, to be honest, I might should as well just go ahead and eat like a gloom resistant. I feel like that's not a bad shout. Like just... Get, get some hearts. Well, granted, I can't get my hearts back right now. Um, let's just eat it anyway for gloom resistance. You need to recall. Wait, really? I thought I thought I could climb. Hold on, let me see if I can climb it. I thought I could chat. Uh-oh. Hey, I was supposed to recall that block. Maybe you're right. But... This could be possible? Oh my god. He's a madman. He's an actual madman. Okay. Anything in these? There's my boy. Literally. What the? I didn't want to get on you. Nothing? Okay. We're moving on. What is all this, man? Oh, we're going the right direction. Dude, oh my god, chat. Whoa. There's so many enemies. What the hell? Power of sa a sage cannot reach. <gasps> what? <gasps> oh, have they my friends? Dude, are you? Ow! down
There it is. Sit down. I'm done. We're out of here. We are now sageless. We went from maidenless with Elden Ring to sageless. Oh, chat. Oh. Bro, what if we use one of these, man? Mighty Zonite Spear? What if you use that? It's also a long sword. What if you use this long sword? Would that be good with that, that thing? Or no? What do we got? It's a... Oh my god, it's, all, it's 44, dude. Weapons on weapons are generally bad. Because the second weapon breaks faster. Yes, I, was, I mean, the horn. What, what? What's the best thing to use for the horn, then? These are 40 attack power. I mean, they're insane, dude. Absolutely nuts. This is a really strong weapon. Maybe Gerudo. I don't have I don't have anything like that yet. I almost need like a gloom sword or something again. You know? It's almost what I need. Flux core. Boomerang. Well, I'll hold these anyways. I'll hold them for now. Grab that too while I'm at it. Why not? Just grab things. Royal bow. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Okay, what is this? Why are they... Are they saying I gotta fly? What are they saying? Oh my... Jesus. Christ, dude. Get the choo-choos out of here. No choo-choo jelly jump scare! Bro, what? What? Fans. I didn't want to use the Zonite though. I didn't want to waste it. <laughs> Chat, that was clean. That was some clean stuff. That was crazy, dude. What? Okay. Let's move out. What we got? What we got? Oh my god, this is gloom? What? Dude, how deep are we? finding so much stuff. Hey, bomb flower, over there. Go. This 
move. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's where we were. <gasps> it's where we were with Zelda. And now we can finally break these rocks that I wanted to break. Oh my goodness. I wanted to break these a long time ago. What? Some God of War energy, dude. What is this? Dude, here's the story. The Zonai come down from the heavens. Raru and Sonya marry each other. Ganon gets the secret stone, kills Sonya. The world is overtaken by Ganon. What is this one? That's not Calamity, Calamity Ganon, I guess? I don't know, maybe it is? Or maybe it's just normal Ganon? Oh, that's when all the sages fight him. Oh. Then Z Zelda, with the Master Sword, becomes the dragon. Dude, that's so sick! Those were the two murals that we didn't see! Her with the Master Sword, and then her becoming the dragon. Oh, dude. It was always meant to happen. Yep. Yep. That's her destiny. Just like some God of War stuff, man. Just like some God of War stuff. Just like the Kratos mural on the wall. That is so cool, man. That is so freaking cool. Wow. I love it. I absolutely love it. This is awesome, dude. What a finale. Imprisoning chamber. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Um. Music. Whoa. Whoa, chat. Here we go. Here we go, dude. It's it. Gloom's Lair. The torch. <gasps> It's Zelda's torch from the beginning! Dude. Oh my god. That's so cool, dude. What? <sighs> Bro. Let's see one of these right now. time we save fuse it to the master sword yo imagine I can't, I can't I can't I don't have any weapon room and I already I already already fused this stuff you know what <laughs> just, just fuse it to the spear fuse it to the shield Wait, the shield's kind of funny. Wait, hold up. <gasps> Yo! We got her torch on our back! Yo! Dude. Put on my big, big outfit. Actually, wait, this outfit's a five. Nah, I still want this. Elden Ring time. What the heck? 
drip over defense. Always, Cowed. Always. Guys, after almost 70 hours of Zelda, we are here to the farthest depths we could possibly go. It's been an absolute pleasure, chat. It's been an absolute pleasure. It's been an absolute freaking pleasure. Minoru, let's do this. Sit down. It's fine. Let's clear some out. Need some lightning up in here. Get blown back. The music. Oh my god, chat. Just use some weapons. Got it. Let's go.
Let's grab a weapon. Oh god. <laughs> get these back up. Let's get these back up, man. The music, oh my god. Woo. You can deal more damage, you ice them and then hit them. Gotcha. Let's do some lightning though. Switch bows for a second, I won't waste all of it. Hey, yo. Get away from me. Do some fire. Sit down. Sit down, dude. Down, man. Easy. Chat, this is so sick, bro. I love that you're fighting his forces one more time. Oh my god. My God, you know, Bo. That's it. What now? That gloom, it means but one thing the Demon King is there. Huh? <gasps> God, it's a thing from Elden Ring. What? It's all the bosses. It's all the bosses. No way. gone they're fighting out there man now it's just us again oh my god well what now chat 
This is stress. I mean, we could, we could, ah, oh, dude. Should I unfuse what's on my Master Sword right now? What is on it right now? 30, it's plus 33. That's not terrible. Man. On this small Zonite sword, I want to put a, uh, or on this long sword, I want to put something. I want to put a, I just, want to, I just want to put something, like, decent. Oh, shit, I didn't mean to do that. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if it's not great. I just need more weapons. <laughs> just in case. The Master Sword. We gotta take it out. Just gotta take out a Lionel bow. Now what? Now what? Oh god, dude. Oh god. Bro. What the heck? My eyes are like watering because I've been playing for so long. Oh, Jesus. Here we go. There he is. Man. How disappointing. Oh, God. This world should be shrouded in darkness, not bathed in insufferable light. All these weak, peace-loving cowards running rampant. It would have been more satisfying to overcome a worthy foe. Shut up. Oh. Badass, dude. What? Is he here? Is he I want to see him in his true... Yeah. I'm happy about this. Oh my god. He's here. Daddy's here. Welcome to the family, son. Damn, he looks sick. Regardless, I will reshape this world as it was meant to be. I will crush any opposition. I will rule. That is what a king must do. Wow. Wow. Do not look away. God. Oh, God. You witness a king's revival. That's so sad. And the birth of his new world. <laughs> oh. <laughs> no shot. Oh my god, we're just doing this. We're just doing this, man. Get parried. Get parried, Ganon. Oh shit. Oh god, I don't know your timing. They made an Elden Ring boss, chat. No! I'm trying to parry him. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. I need food. Full recovery. Whoa. What's that do? What's that do, bro? 
No! Bro, he's so strong. I, I literally, I don't. That looks bad. Ow. Ow, ow, ow. Holy hell, the music, dude. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh my goodness. <laughs> what? What? Take this. There goes the torch. Bye bye, Zelda torch. at me bro that's right try it again try it again try it again huh eh? guess what I got where is it where's my boys where's my boys at where are they at hold up hold up <laughs> hold up hey hold up hold up a second there it is choo choo jelly that's how I wanted meet my choo choos that's right that's actually really good. What? Ow! Oh my god. Ow! God, chat! Jesus Christ, bro. I don't have enough health for this! Oh my god. That's a crazy dodge. Hey! Chill, 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 bro. Cut you apart. Huge fairy. Sit down. Huge fairy. Let's go! Huge Perry! Let's go! You're done! Oh my god! Huge Perry! Oh my god! Let's go! Oh my god. The timing chat! You're done! You're done! What a feeling. I had almost forgotten the thrill of battle. That feeling as blood surges in my veins. Oh God. I am not even near the limits of my power. Oh my God. Oh my God. What do I do? Um, what? Sorry for keeping you waiting. Are they here? Tulin! The lad! The lad! Tulin! Help me! Yes! Yes, bro! Yes! Oh 
Oh my god. Ow! Let's take him down together. Oh my god, dude. Huge parry. Dude, his health bar goes off the screen, guys. The health bar? The health bar is behind my face cam. Oh my god. Oh god, dude. Oh, we're done. We're we're so out of here. We're so dead. I, I have nothing. Like, what? I... This is so... This is... What can I do? Guys. I'm dead. The music, bro. I, I don't know what I can do. I have to take out a cooking pot. <laughs> hold up, hold up, I gotta cook. Hold up. No, it went away. Hold on. No! No! <laughs> God. I'm I'm dead. <laughs> oh my god. Eat the food with yellow hearts? Does that work? It doesn't work. It's only full recovery. It doesn't work all the way, right? Do yellow hearts. Oh my god. Bro, I... Oh my god, no way. No shot, guys. Oh no. <laughs> oh my god. How? How? We're dead. Dude. Bro. All my friends are dead.
my god, if I would have gotten that that one off, I would have been so close, dude. Oh. Oh, the 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 flurry rush or whatever, fury rush, whatever it's called, when you on it when you evade that slam that he does, you get a lot of damage in. Oh my god, I have to do all that again. Oh, I should have cooked more food. I'm a dumbass. <laughs> I should have cooked more food. <laughs> no. Oh Jesus. <laughs> Ow. Kettle. Dude, I got you. Ow! Oh my god, dude. Do I not have... Okay. Also, really fast. Chat, my headset's about to die. Hold on, let me switch really fast. <sighs> okay. I know, I did pretty well for my first time. I really did. I really think I did. That was rough. That was really rough. But you know what? This is a sick boss. Like, I, it's really well made. Um, oh my god. Um, I do. Attack up, let's go. Wait, where's my, oh my God, my arrows are out. Are you kidding me? Let's go. Whoa. I'm getting, I'm getting destroyed again, dude. Bro, dude, why can't I, I hate that to press this to block. Oh my God. Bro, I'm so screwed again. Wait, did that not work? What? Do I really not have any more gloom? Bro, I might as well just restart. I'm gonna restart. Just kill me. Kill me. I want to die. I, I need to cook food. I need to cook, like, I need to cook gloom things. Oh my God, dude. This guy. You saw some gloom stuff? It's still like, I was I was wasting it though. I mean, I'm in phase one of the fight, and I, I, I don't have, like, anything. Like, I need way more than that. Um. Like, literally spam these. Literally just need to spam those. 
Deploy tactical veggie straws. <laughs> Super coffee, yes. Yes, I have them in front of me, but I'm like... <laughs> Honestly, kind of kind of true, dude. Kind of true. Let me, let me just... <laughs> dude, thank you so much. Right, well, let me... Right, that's better. That's better to have some of those. Do I have anything else? Oh, God. Um. I got it. Tsurukami, thank you. Let's go. 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 Why in the world are the controls in this game where I, if I press the block button when I'm holding an arrow, I'm pulling out an arrow. It's so confusing sometimes. God dang it. There we go. Are you kidding? Reset right now. Where is it? <sighs> I'm just eating everything. I'm eating small things, chat. Get like I've got coal resistance for no reason. Who cares? Run at me again. I really did again. Whoa, what? Let's go. Oh. Thank God. Thank God. Thank God, dude. What a feeling. I get it. I know. Oh my god, we just did a flurry rush combo. It's time to finish him off, Link. Oh yeah. Let's go, baby.
do let's do Dude, my parries are on point right now. Yanobo, get out of my way, dog. <laughs> oh my god. Do my parries. Chat, that was so clean. That was so clean. That was so clean. Lumpy again, have a great night. Woo. Wanna see us again? Try fusing arrow light dragon fragment. You mean like the new um the new thing I got? Yeah, I could try. Do I love that though? Mm. Do I got him this time? I got him this time, baby. Ow. <laughs> What I'm doing is working, so I'm not going to change my strat. Where's my choo-choos? You know what? Take a portable pot. F you. <laughs> oh, shoot. You're so done. I got you now. I know every strat now. You're so done, bro. No, oh, I had the arrow out. Damn it. <laughs> no shot. Let's go, baby. You're done. It's over. Chat, it's done. That's it! Let's go! Dude, I was so on point. see Zelda's dragon fight with him, aren't we? That's gonna be so cool if that happens, please. Yeah, it looks like Calamity Ganon. It does. 
Dude, where I think I think Zelda's gonna help us here. It's too cool for like a dragon and a dragon fighting each other in the sky, right? Like that's gotta happen, right? That's gotta happen. Come on. Come on. Come on, dude. Come on. Please. Please give me that, Nintendo. Please. What is going on? I can't believe he, dude, he literally sacrificed everything that he is to kill Link. Oh, that looks like Calamity Ganon. I, don't, I guess it's not, but it looks so similar. It just keeps going, yeah. What the hell, guys? Draconified Demon King. Wow. That's terrifying. Is that us? <gasps> oh my... Bro. I knew it. I knew it, chat. Yes! Yes! <gasps> I believe I'm like tearing up. I'm like actually tearing up. Are we about to are we about to play on top of this? What? <gasps> Guys, what? <laughs> Dude. Dude, jump off? Oh. Trying to help us. Oh my god, dude. How do I. The whole dragon's gloom? Well, that works. I get my. Oh, I get my health back. Holy. Zelda? <laughs> no shot! No shot, bro! What the f this game? This game is crazy! What the hell, man? Are you kidding me? Oh my god! Chat. Where, where's my boy Tulin? God dang it. I need the ability. Tulin, where are you at? <laughs> oh my god, dude.
Oh my god. How did they program this? How? Am I like... Dude. D this is such a Sonic boss battle. It is, chat. It's so awesome. Oh, shit. I go. It's so badass. Like, like, look, I'm just going to fall. Let's see if she picks me up. Oh my god. Oh. That's actually crazy, dude. I'm like, I actually have tears. It's just the idea of her being a little dragon. <laughs> like, god dang it, bro. No. Oh my god. Zelda, help me. <laughs> The moon. Oh my God. What? Last one. Thank you, Zelda. Thank you. Oh my God, bro. Wow. Oh no! No! I made it! Oh! What do I do? <laughs> Are you kidding me, guys? Final attack!
How is this on a switch? How? How is this on a switch? God, look at that shot with the shield, too. Jesus. Oh, great. Oh, great. Time to cry. Please, God, save her. Please, God. Arms healed too. <laughs> oh, stop! Stop! Who are you crying? Oh, shit. Oh, God. I'm literally, like, I'm literally fully crying. Oh, my God. Jesus. What a masterpiece, Jesus Christ. I literally have tears for the Grab. Oh. Oh my god, dude. done <laughs> that was really well done Nintendo Jesus Christ
it's so much is set. It's so show don't tell as well. There's like not a single word spoken after you fight Ganon. Not a single word. <laughs> Till now, probably. But still, like during all of that. sleeping all this time but when I felt something like a warm loving embrace I woke up thank you Link, I met such wonderful people. I saw Hyrule as it was. I have so much to tell you. So much happened. Oh, Link, I'm home. Oh my god. I really like, I, I don't know what to say.
that, like, That, that, like, I, I, I just, God, I can't speak. I, the, the, the bit where, the bit where the music just swells and it's just her free falling. It's just, I, I literally, I literally was just, the music, oh my God. I was literally just overcome with like a wave of tears. No pun intended. Like they said, it, it's Zelda Tears of the Kingdom because those are the tears that I am having at the end of this game. That is what they wanted to make us do is have tears. I don't know, I it wasn't even like sad or anything. I don't even, like it wasn't, it wasn't necessarily sad. It was just the mu, it, it's something about the music and the moment just all swell together. And it just creates this, like, I don't know, man. Um, just something that I'll never forget. Like, I, I think that... I don't... I don't... Oh, man. Man. God. I feel like the ending of this game was so strong. Like, like the, the beginning of the game is super strong. The ending of the game is super strong. There's some stuff in the middle that's a little like, eh, like I don't need the story repeated a bunch of times like it does, but the ending is exact, like that is exactly what I wanted. Like exactly what I wanted. I wanted a fight that felt like I mean, it was, it was practically like a Souls, it felt like a Souls fight against Ganon. And then I was like, okay, what I would want is I want like a dueling of dragons in some way in the sky. And I got that. I got that. And not to mention just getting the Master Sword alone, that whole moment. I, I, I think this game I think this game is better than Breath of the Wild in every way. Every way. I literally don't even know what Breath of the Wild did better than this game. I think this game is so much better than Breath of the Wild. I I I love Breath of the Wild. It was really fun as my first Zelda game. But this is this was clearly what they wanted to get to. Clearly. Remember a couple of years ago you said you wanted this to be a kid's first game? Imagine when they get to that Gandorf battle. Gandorf battle. Yeah, I mean, you know, I. Yeah, it'd be tough. It'd be really tough. Yeah, I, I, I just not, not. I'm not trying to put down Breath of the Wild. I just, I just think this game was, like, this game ex exceeded the hype. Like, how do you make a sequel? How do you make a sequel to Breath of the Wild that's better? With the same map, dude. It's the same map. And every other, like, like that just sounds, like, on paper, it's like, oh, it just seems like it's going to be familiar and I'm, you know, not going to have as much fun. No way, right? Like, you know, Breath of the Wild is probably going to be more fun, right? Because I explored it all for the first time, right? But then it's like, oh, boom, depths. Oh, boom, Sky Islands. Oh, boom, all the places you knew were changed. Oh, boom, caves everywhere. Literally caves everywhere. Oh, boom, more boss things to fight. Like, oh my God, it's just more, more, more cosmetics to find. More like cool armor to get. So, dude. I have so many thoughts. 
Plus the map is twice as big, yeah. Wow. Yeah, I'll get post credit scene. Okay. I'll, I'll stay. I, I'm gonna let the credits play. This is just this is just incredible, dude. All the all the hand grabs. Every hand grab. <laughs> It's so funny. Oh. Wow. That right there, dude. So, what, what's the canon reason of how Zelda gets revived, chat? Dude, that bit. Oh my god. They show. The end. And Haru? Oh my god. I can't believe such an impressive landmass can float in the sky. Even you're here? Just when I thought I'd started to figure the zone eye out. Minoru? Everyone. I am glad I was able to bring you all here. I wanted to share this view of Hyrule with all of you. Whoa! I've never been this far up before, Goro! Wow, what a sight it is! And Zelda, you were roaming the skies all along? Yes, although I don't really remember. I never thought I would actually stand here again. This is only a theory, but... Raru's power of light, and Sonya's time power. For Zelda to transform back, they both must have channeled their abilities through you, Link. Oh. I see. Seems. No. It is my time. Minoru. Do not worry. You have overcome the burden my era left to you. 
You have proven yourself, and you no longer need me. I know I can move on. Join Raru and the others, and the world will be safe. What, Tulin? Hmm. Hmm. Ravu and Sonia will be happy to hear of this. But Minoru... <laughs> and now let them know just how much you care. King Raru, Queen Sonia, Minoru, the ancient sages, they wished not only to save Hyrule from the Demon King, but for it to see eternal peace. I will dedicate myself to that goal. Now, and for all time. My friends, with all of your strength, stand with me. My switch is like going to sleep. Don't go to sleep, Switch. That was really cute. That was really freaking cute. Is that it? There it is. There it is. Wow. Wow. What a game. We finished the game at 4 a.m. in the morning. You guys are the real ones. I just want to say, before I even talk about the game here for a second, I just want to say thank you all so much for watching, not only watching this playthrough, but a lot of you guys were there for Breath of the Wild like in 2020 when I first played Zelda for the first time. And thank you all so much for supporting this 
this series as much as y'all have. Like this is like the thirteenth episode, and we've consistently had like a really awesome vibe on stream, and I just I really appreciate it. Um, I really do think. I honestly, with I'm just gonna say it with this ending. I think this is one of the greatest gaming experiences I've ever had in my life. <laughs> I think this is easily on a top ten list of like best games I've ever played. Like easily, I I never thought I would say that about Zelda because I I never grew up with it. But this this game that that entire ending, just everything that you progress to, I think is just is gorgeous. I I don't I don't know how they did this. Like I just don't know how they did this. It's on a switch, man. Like think about how old the switch is at this point. You can literally fuse and mend objects and build things and put fast travel points yourself and do this and that and this and that. It tracks your entire progress everywhere you go in the game, your hero's journey. Like, you can recall objects. It's like, how did they do this? How did they do this? And how did they deliver an ending like that? It, like, there's not a single frame rate drop in, in the ending. The only time I ever had a frame rate drop, uh, drop in this game was like, when there's like a bunch of enemies on screen sometimes. Like I had it a little bit when the we were fighting like the Demon King army towards the end. But like how does like the dragon set piece. How does that have no frame rate drops for me? How was that possible? Like it looked gorgeous. There was laser. There was, there was like a giant nuke laser that went off on Ganon. And... It looked like I was playing this on a PS5, man. I, I don't even understand. Like, I have no idea how they did this. And for that alone, I think this game is a technological masterpiece. I, I genuinely, I, I, like, I, I know people have been hyping it up like crazy to be that, but it's true. This game is wizardry. Like you guys are saying in the chat right now, Purgatory just said that. It's wizardry. I don't know how they did it. I don't know how they did it. Sorry, I should have the, the alerts back on. Alerts are back. Of the year, game of the year. Final Fantasy 16 got nothing on this. <laughs> game Awards 2023 will be a Coliseum. Listen, man. For Final Fantasy to be my game of the year after this, it has to be a solid, solid, amazing story and experience. I don't... This is this is by far my game of the year right now. Not even close. Not even close. This is definitely game of the year for me. Um, which is wild because I, I love RE4. I think RE4 is a masterpiece as well. Um, but I, I think this game is technologically something insane. I don't this is a game that like like I feel like this game could get people into video games. I, I like I, I feel like this is a game where like if there's someone like like Emmy right like if there's something that em, like I could give Emmy and be like hey here's a switch go play this game and enjoy it for 300 hours just go just go enjoy it do whatever you want explore whatever you want find whatever land you want like just enjoy it and it delivers I I played this very chill I didn't rush it like crazy I didn't uh, speed run the main story or anything like that. I did every region. I did some side quests here or there. And it still took me over like close to 70 hours. That's insane, dude. Like that's insane. Like it, it, for someone who's taking their time on this game, it's going to be like a 90 hour game at least. And I was I was taking my time a little bit, but towards the end I was like, all right, let's let's get through it because we got we got to get through it before uh, Final Fantasy comes out. But I didn't speed run it. I mean, I, if I speed run it, we would have beat it last night. I was like, okay, okay, let's let's chill, let's do one more night, let's give it a little breather. Here we go. 
But yeah, I this is just amazing, dude. I I don't even know what to say. <laughs> I feel like this go like I feel like in terms of like open world video games, this goes down in history as like one of the best of all time. It's better than Breath of the Wild. I I think it's I think Breath of the Wild is really fun and it's very relaxing um to explore and and and, and stuff like that, but I think this game has way more satisfying exploration. I think there's way more satisfying things going on. You, there's so many things to upgrade that's way more satisfying. I, I think, I think, like this and like this and Elden Ring in my brain are like the two best open world games I've ever played. Like genuinely, I, I'm trying to think of like another open world game that comes close. Like it's this and it's this and Elden Ring. Like, dude, like, oh my God. And what I love is they both do things that like they are both uniquely good at. Like this game is good in a, its own way that's different from Elden Ring and Elden Ring's good in its own way that's different from this game. Now, if you combine some of the things from both games, then what is that? Like the perfect video game? <laughs> I don't know, dude. <laughs> I haven't played Red Dead Redemption 2. For context, I have not played that. I played Red Dead, Red Dead Redemption 1 growing up, and I did love Red Dead Redemption 1. I would say it's one of the best open world games ever, but I but I feel like definitively this and Elden Ring the last two years have like defined what this is, what this genre is. So yeah. I don't know, I want to read what some of you guys said. Um I think it's part because we're used to bad performance from AAAs on launch. Yeah. Yeah. It's like a, it, it like breaks belief. Yeah. No, I hear you. I hear you. Yeah. Like compared to like, like in, in no offense, like I'm, it's, it's, it's generally not the dev's fault, but like, you know, like Jedi survivor had a lot of frame rate issues and it was kind of open worldy. Um, and, and this just like shows how much like I I don't know this is wiz wizardry dude I don't know I don't know how they did this they just I could, they just let it cook for a long time you were so happy in the air so things on the land below weren't loaded in so I didn't put a load on the switch yeah I guess so oh man Grim thank you for that reset by the way I appreciate it and Metro thank you for giving that sub to Flash Prime during that. Thanks so much for continuously creating awesome content, JC. WDH, thank you so much for saying that, and thank you for being here. Um, that was that was awesome. Like, it 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 takes like like I I know that I I it's a meme that I cry at some games, but. What I think is so special is that I didn't expect to, I didn't expect to cry at all in this game. Didn't expect that. And it and and it's something that it's something to be said when like you cry because a moment is sad. Like, oh, that upsets me. You killed my favorite character. Like that really upsets me. I'm gonna I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna have some tears shed, right? You know? But there's something to be said where I'm crying and I don't know why. Like I don't know why. Like I'm sitting there going oh my God, there's a feeling that I can only get from playing a video game. It's the same, I, it, it happened to me, it's happened to me a couple times. It happened to me at the end of Zombies, obviously because that felt like more than a video game, right? That felt like the end of my life in some ways. So I cried during that, I cried at the end of this. Like I'm trying to think of moments where I didn't cry because it was sad, right? I'm crying because it's just something, emo like something, some magic, I don't know. It's like, it's end of zombies. It's this. It's uh, probably another one it is near Automata, and that's why that game resonated with me so well because the ending of near Automata is like it like breaks the idea of what a video game is in some ways, and I'm just like it like it almost like breaks through the screen somehow and just makes you feel this well of emotions. I was really like not to spoil near Automata, but like I was crying during like eight bit gameplay. Like it was bizarre. I, I don't know what was going on there. It was magic. Um, 
<laughs> it was like eight bit. It was like you know what I'm talking about. If you know, and it's just like in this, like the the dragon bit. I started tearing up, and then when when the music just kicks and you see her, and and like all all that journey culminates into that one catch, the one catch that you wish that you could have done at the start of the game, but in some ways it comes back around, just like all all things in time in this game all comes back around you know you miss her at the beginning you catch her in the exact same pose at the end it's beautiful like genuinely beautiful i cried yeah i cried at the end of ragnarok as well yes that's another good one it's another good one it wasn't even necessarily sad in some moments where i was crying but yeah that's another good one i i definitely cried on that one too god JC, you're amazing creator. I love everything you do. You made this special playthrough special, and I can't wait to watch Final Fantasy 16 with you. You're freaking awesome, dude. Metro, I appreciate that so much, dude. Thank you. Dude, you guys made this playthrough fun, man. This playthrough was, you know, we had to put it on pause for a second because I, you know, I don't know what happened. I, I had to go some. I don't know what happened. I went somewhere or or Final Fantasy 16 demo came out or something. I don't remember. Uh Oh, was it the Oh yeah, was it the couple of days? Oh, bro. At was I employed at the start of this playthrough? <laughs> I think I was. That's why this playthrough felt like it took so long. Oh my god. Bro, I think I think when this game came out, I was like I dude, what has happened since the start of this? I literally had like, oh my god. What? That's crazy. Oh my god. <laughs> you need the neat stat buff. What's neat mean? What does that mean? Do you think this game has has high ESG scores? What's ESG score? What is that? What does that mean? Not an education, employment, or training. Oh, I didn't know that. What's ESG? Environmental, social, and governance? Wait, what? what certified ma 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 ma. Bro, I literally, I, I'm so confused by the ESG thing. What do you mean by that? <laughs> oh, God. Dude, I just, like, I like how there's just no music as well on the menu. It's just like, all right, you're done. You're done. You're absolutely done. God, dude. Oh my god, dude. I Let's keep talking about Zelda because I'm seeing a Final Fantasy review scores coming in. Just hold on, hold that thought for a second. Um let's talk. What do you guys want to talk about with Zelda? We got to put the, we got to put the end of this chapter. What 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 else is there even to say? Should I should I talk about like I don't know. You you guys ask me. What what do we do? Like I'm not gonna go to bed right away. You guys know me. I can't I can't go to bed immediately after beating the game. I gotta like talk about it for a second. Let me get some like. What happens when you continue it? By the way. Oh wow. Oh wow! Like it just it, yeah, it just goes right back before the thing. Interesting. Very very interesting. Next Switch game you play play on stream? Uh, I'm not sure about Switch. I I want to play more, but um, I was telling chat that I want to do like, I want to play like Mario 64. Like I want to play like some classic game at some point on stream. Um, once we get like a a free a free moment, 
like I want to play some classic Nintendo stuff because I I didn't grow up with Nintendo like everybody else did. I played I played Sega. I was a Sonic guy. I, I Sonic Adventure, Sonic Adventure Two were my jam. So I, I played that instead of <laughs> Mario sixty four. Uh, if DLC gets released, will you play it? Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. Especially I didn't do it with Breath of the Wild, but this one I would be so down. How the f do they top this, dude? I don't know. Well, okay. I think I think for one, I will say I I would I would give this game a ten out of ten easily. Like this is a ten out of ten video game. Like you know what I mean. Like if you're not calling this a ten out of ten, I don't know what your standards are for video games. But but this is that this is definitely a ten out of ten. I mean, subjective opinion. That being said, I think there are things that they could have done better. It's not perfect. It's not perfect. It's just. Overall, the whole package is so good that it's definitely a 10 out of 10. But every game, I think, can always have room, room, room for improvement. Developers say all the time, they're like, dude, even when they ship games and they get good reviews, they still wish they could work on stuff more. And I, I would say, like, where do they go from here? I don't know. I, I would want them to go, like, I don't know the Zelda lore, lore like you guys do. But what I would love is I would love to see them go to another land. I would love to see them go to, I don't know, like just a, another world, another like, uh, I don't, I don't want to say space, but like just literally just go somewhere else, go somewhere th than Hyrule and let this be forever for a bit, maybe not forever, but let it be for a bit like the Hyrule open world games where Breath of the Wild and Tears, right? I've done that before. No, I imagine they have. I'm just saying, I think they should do that again, though. Like, I, I think, I don't know how you're, how would you even build on top of this? You would have to wipe the map. Like, a damn, what are they going to do? A meteor has hit Hyrule, and now the world is different again. Like, that would just wouldn't, <laughs> like, like, I don't know. Like, it's got to be something different, you know? Like, they have to do something different. I don't know. With not the Fortnite way, like literally. <laughs> space next time, dude. I still think Horizon's gonna end up in space somewhere. I don't know why I, I've just thought of that, but Horizon's definitely gonna go towards space at some point. Um, yeah, I'm trying to look at what you guys, I'm trying to look at what you guys are saying. I was saying something about the whole time travel and how the effect of Breath of the Wild will still occur. Well, Breath of the Wild de technically starts before this, right? Or am I going insane? Breath of the Wild is before this. Right? Because, like, you, when you save her at the end, and they even, when you have the castle bit, they, like, remind you of the stuff in Breath of the Wild. So it's not like a prequel or anything, right? Like, I think this is definitely the sequel. How about they add an underground lab part to the spawn? Oh, stop it, dude. <laughs> stop, bro. I know exactly what you're talking about. That was a, that that almost got me, and then I thought about it a little bit long longer than that. When you said spawn, spawn gave it away. JC, would you like to see each other my favorite Zelda game growing up? Uh, give me, give me a bit, give me a second, Grim, because I, I want to like, I want to like, I want to, I want to dive into this for a second before we get like talking about the other games and stuff like that. You know what I mean? No offense, I'm not trying to be mean or anything. Hope you understand. What, what other big hitters do we have this year? Just so Final Fantasy 16 Armor Core, and then with Spider Man, you have Starfield, uh, Alan Wake. Alan Wake might be like a really good survival horror game like Resident Evil. Cyberpunk DLC. I think the Twilight Realm should invade Hyrule. I don't know what the Twilight Realm is. See, this is why I need to play some of the older Zelda games because I have no idea. Is that what Twilight Princess is? Is that what is that what that is? from the best Zelda game ever. Damn. 
my my one burning question about going into Tears of the Kingdom is what happened to the Divine Beast and Sheikah Tex? Yeah, that is weird. I I again, this is something that this is something that I think like when you start getting into like the criticisms of this game, I think. I, I think I think that that is some some of like some of the some of the major criticism I have not major but like things that like I I would want to be improved next time is I think the story while I love it it's way better than Breath of the Wild story I think my opinion I think it's way more interesting the ending is phenomenal the master sword section is phenomenal like they elevate this game to another another level but I you know I, we we mentioned it during the playthrough but. There's just like weird, like the way that they tell some of the the story and like of what's going on in the world and and the regions. Like I just I wish there was something that they could do where it doesn't feel like I'm just completing like a checklist of a region. And bear with bear with me for one second. Let me let me just let me just say this. It's like when you give me like four regions. What I really, really want is I want each region to really feel unique. And it does gameplay-wise. It does gameplay-wise. But story-wise, it doesn't. It doesn't matter. Like, hardly at all. Like, it doesn't... Like, it could be pollution. It could be, oh my god, there's armies invading this time. It's like, even though, even though they slightly change what the problem is for each region it's not that memorable compared to all the other story stuff in the game. Like the, the teardrops on the ground are way more memorable than anything that you do with uh, like, you know, Bo and, and all these guys, no offense to them. I think they're really cool, but I just, I, I don't understand why. Like, I think they made it that way though, because you could go to any one you want. And that's why it's like, okay, maybe I went to the volcano first or went to this but we talked about it. It's like, I think my least favorite part of the storytelling of this game is l knowing immediately who the sage is going to be in each region. Immediately. It's like no questions asked. That's the sage. That's going to be the sage. He's going to get the power. And we're going to have this like, you know, two minute cut scene at the end where some masked, you know, similar race person uh, to, to Yonobo or whatever is going to tell him, I don't know who the mass people are hardly at all, but I just, he's going to, they're going to tell him that he's important. He's going to go, Oh man, I'm important. And I'm like, I could have told you that because it's very obvious that you're important. And then, uh, and then you get the same backstory about Ganon, like four, like legitimately like four or five times in the game. It's kind of nuts. Like they repeat the whole, like imprisoning Ganon thing legitimately so much. I was like, dude, you got to tell me something different. Like, I, I know this already. I don't know how they would structure it, but they, they need to find a way to, like, give me a different piece of the puzzle, just like you did with the tears, just like you did with the tears, where I got different pieces of the story. It's so funny because with the tears, they're fully okay. Nintendo's fully okay with letting you see all the tears out of order. They're like, Oh, that doesn't matter. Go find a glyph and go go whatever. You can click on it right away and and watch the last tier if you want. But with the regions, they're like, oh, hold on. We got to explain this again. They might not know. It's like, bro. I don't I, like. It's so weird. Like I, I I don't I don't understand what that is. Like I, because like you would think, like like. You would think that the most important cutscene that they would probably repeat four or five times is that Zelda ate, ate a stone, turned into a dragon for years of her life, like infinite amounts of time to make the Master Sword happen, right? That would be a cutscene that I could see them being like, oh, we got to explain this. We, like, if they forgot, we, they got to know because the whole dragon thing is going to happen in the end. But, like, I don't need to know that they imprisoned Ganon. I know that, like, from the second that the game starts. So like I don't know why they repeat that scene so much. It's so odd. Um, and then with the other really heavy stuff, they don't repeat it at all. <laughs> so I'm like, what? Like, what do you mean? I mean, they do a little bit, but not even close to the same. It's it's odd. It's really odd. I, that is like my biggest criticism of the story. 
is that the story feels like it doesn't really progress until you get the master sword it like in terms of like the overall story like it doesn't it doesn't it feels like like oh like zelda is a puppet and there's a puppet zelda oh guess what every single region is going to tell you the same thing you know what i mean um like i think it'd be cool if like okay maybe in zora land they're fo- they're, they're ge- they genuinely have pollution right they have a pollution problem and it's because of this like crazy thing in the sky and that's really different and there's like two characters or something there's Sidon and there's another one that are with you and you don't know who's going to be the, the the sage and i think it'd be really cool to like have a scene where you're like oh shoot it's going to be them oh sick and imagine that and then you save the puppet thing for another region okay in Yonobo world, like the volcano world, now we're seeing images of Zelda and we're like, whoa, that's the first time we've seen that in a region. You know what I mean? Like there's ways that they could have like like split up some of the stuff and, and structured it a little bit different. So it's not just like the same thing. And then also the other thing is that Link never tells the characters anything, which I get it. He's a silent protagonist, but God dang it, dude. If I go to another region... And the and the the person that's clearly the sage is right there. Why doesn't Link just tell them that they're supposed to be a sage? Like he should just tell them immediately. Like he knows already. <laughs> like he knows he knows everything. Half th- there were scenes in this game where they they're like, "Where's Zelda?" Link knows, and he won't tell them. And so I think that's odd. That that is honestly my biggest complaint about the game. Sorry, I don't mean to like rant for a second but i just want to throw it out there like that's that's my biggest complaint about the game is i think that the story the story structure could have been better i think the ending act three of the game is phenomenal and same with act one i think act one is phenomenal as well i think it's the it's the middle it's the regions and doing those regions feels very checklisty i don't like that it feels checklisty i wish it was more like each region really has a defined thing that really feels different not just oh, here's another young sage that I know is going to be a sage immediately when I get there. It's just not surprising. It's not a surprising story thread. But the Master Sword stuff, that was surprising. And that's why I was like, oh, what? You know what I mean? So, like, that, that's, that's, that's a big thing. It felt very like, okay, we're doing the same thing we kind of did in Breath of the Wild. There's going to be somebody that helps me with a divine beast, and there's going to be someone that helps me over here with a divine beast. You know what I mean? Like, it, it felt similar to that. And, and I, I, it wasn't my favorite part. Uh, what are you guys saying? It would have been cooler if we got to see a glimpse into the sages' lives themselves. It would have made each sage more unique. Yeah, 100%. 100%. I don't remember a single sage. Like, the actual old sages, I don't remember any, any of their names, and I don't know them hardly at all, which is odd. And weirdly, I think, like, there's some similarities in the story that that I think, like, bear with me. Sonic Frontiers kind of did a similar story to this. Like there was this ancient race, uh, called I think they called them the the ancients in Frontiers. It, it's basically equivalent of the Zonai, and the sort of reveals that happen with that race are really cool. Um, and I think they did some really cool stuff there. Um, but I also, I don't know. I'm also a Sonic nerd, so who do I know? We didn't get, like, a ton of reveals about the Zonai. It was kind of just, like, they just came down at some point. It's just an ancient race of beings. And they have all these stones. You know, which I thought were cool, though. I thought that was really cool. It genuinely is the worst thing about the game. Very weird. Yeah, the story, though. I'm pretty sure in canon, the only two words we actually hear Link say are in Wind Waker. Really? <laughs> the middle is mid- <laughs> I do like the, how they hit you with that you thought it was over thing. Yes. And I got to say, the, the, out of all the sages, Minoru, shout out to Minoru. Like one of the best sections of the game, in my opinion. It was a little weird, like being in like a mech and stuff, but that was one of my favorite sections of the game. Like I, I was like, dude, holy hell. You, you literally like are playing like Titanfall Zelda or something. And there's probably so much more you can do with even the mech with all the fusions that I didn't even, you know, find out. 
Um, but there's all of that. And like that whole boss fight in like the sort of ring where you're you're playing as like the you know the Titan and you're you're fighting and you have to like bounce them into this like that was so cool like that was so much better and it felt uniquely defined and that's why I liked it so much because story wise it was so cool it was like oh wait there's a hidden sage who's it gonna be and I was like I I think it's Minoru and so there's a little bit of that surprise and then it's like okay you gotta find the the secret entrance to get to like the sky island of it and and find out like the laser and it's like it was kind of like an indiana jones thing to get to that stone it was way more interesting um than than some of the others uh that being said i will say this the temples in this game like hats off to nintendo i genuinely don't know what i don't know what temple is my favorite i don't know uh, w w disregarding minerals because i don't know if that counts but disregarding Minoru, like out of the four regions, I actually don't know which one's my favorite. I think they were all really well, well done. I think the pirate ship thing was super cool. The, the boss fight there in the sky was so pretty. I thought the rock boss fight was super fun seeing Yonobo like go around the arena. Um, I, I thought that uh, like all the rail cars and everything were super cool in that temple. Um, I, I, I love the water temple. I thought the water temple was a little bit short because all the, the bubbles were super fun to use. Um, but I loved it all the same. It was awesome. It definitely seemed like the beginning one in some ways, uh, like a beginner temple. Uh, and then I don't know, like the, there was just, it was just some cool stuff, man. Like it, it was really well done. I liked them way more than the divine beast stuff. I'm trying to even remember the divine beast stuff. All I remember is just like, like every divine beast kind of had the same structural look to it, to it in some ways. Like, it was made out of the same parts, even though there were different, like, animals. And then you would fight, like, a, like some thing of Ganon at each one, right? Right? I, I feel like overall, yeah, overall the temples in this game were way better. And that's not even including the mazes. The mazes? Dude, shout out to another amazing thing. The mazes felt awesome. That was super fun. Getting that reward and getting that armor that I wore all the way to the end, that's a story, dude. That's like a video game story. Like, that's a that's a memory I'm always going to remember. Like, oh, dude, yeah, like, my journey was, I got to, I got to the point in the playthrough where I did, I just, I just maxed out all the mazes. I did them all and got this sick Ganon armor from a previous game and just, like, wore that to the end, like, Chad Link. Like, that was really cool. Um, so, I don't know. I, I really liked that bit, too. That, that was... There was a lot of really fun moments. I love the water temples aesthetic. It was, yeah, it was so good. It was so good. Oh man. Easiest water temple in Zelda game. I I bet. I bet, honestly. If Fire Temple had my favorite boss, but Pyramid Thunder Temple is my favorite. Yeah, the 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 Pyramid Thunder Temple is cool. The lights, I really like that. That that felt like an old Sonic game for me. I really enjoyed that one. I think Hyrule Castle is sort of like a dungeon. Yeah. Yeah. I wish there was a little bit more puzzle solving at Hyrule. I think that would have been cool if there was like, if they if they made it a little bit more temple where it's like, okay, things have changed in the castle and you have to unlock these doors by doing something. I don't know. I, I, w I was expecting that and it didn't happen. It was kind of just like, oh, just run through them and, and kill them. Um, But I... Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if that's something I, I... I liked that it was a temple, but I, I wish there was a little bit more to it because it kind of felt just like, oh, go to where Zelda is, fight things. Go to where Zelda is, fight things. I wish there was a little bit more puzzles because uh, this game is so puzzle heavy. Like, this game is such a puzzle game. Like, give me some puzzles in the, in the big castle, dude. That sounds sick, you know? Like, think of, like, Elden Ring. There's some, like, crazy moments in Elden Ring where you're like, how do I get around this and around this? And then when you figure it out, you're like, oh! my god i made a shortcut for myself oh like that feeling didn't have that at all at the castle which is unfortunate because it's like it's the castle dude like come on um but yeah i overall though it was cool like there was so much content and that's the thing like that's the thing that i'm taking away from this is like this is content the game like they went above and beyond to give you so many things to do and do i like every single second of it no do I think every single second of it is a masterpiece? No, but 
the overall package being the way that it is is such a masterpiece. It's insane. I think Ultra Hand is overlooked because of how great the game is itself. You can build insane things in this game if you want to. Yeah. Yeah. It you yeah. Yeah. You like someone said in the chat, like building a TIE fighter. <laughs> building like some contraption like I, I saw somebody on twitter had like a contraption to like like they would trap animals like like cows in it and then they like had like a fire emitter <laughs> and they they're like this is gonna be the place where we get the meat and i'm like what the f what is going on with the community on this game it's crazy um so i thought that like that was cool there's just all these different things you can build do you think zelda play a sufficient role in this game um Oh man, I, I I think I think I think so. I think I think story wise, absolutely. I think she she definitely played a part story wise, and she she makes the ultimate sacrifice, you know, in many ways. Like like Zelda is is a is a character to me that is selfless and 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 God. I mean, look, I I I. I'm not going to be, I don't know if it's weird to like ship Zelda and Link. I don't know how like community feels about that kind of thing, but dude, she loves that, that, that lad. She loves him so much. Like, can you imagine having the willpower to do what she did for him and for the kingdom? Like, bro, she literally ate like an infinity stone that is all about time powers. And became like this crazy, crazy like dragon, like maybe even suffering. We don't know what that exactly meant. Um, it seemed like she wasn't doing too like well in that form over the however many years, thousands of years or whatever. I don't know how many years it was, but the like, yeah, like I I don't know, like I I just think that. I think that story wise, she absolutely had a role and she was so integral to this, the, su the success of this. And I, I, I love, I love what they did with her and like the time travel stuff. It was so interesting. I really liked it. Um, that being said, I'm not gonna lie. I thought when they first announced this game that we'd be able to play as Zelda. That's me as someone who only played Breath of the Wild. I thought that that might happen and it didn't. And some people were saying that that's really never really happened too much at all. And I'm, so I'm like, okay, makes sense if it didn't happen. But like, it felt so set up for her to have some sort of gameplay. Like in the beginning, like they, they're practically wearing like, like similar outfits like she looks like battle ready. <laughs> like, you know what I mean? Like she, it's, she's not wearing like some princess like dress or anything like that. Like she's literally like wearing like a really cool outfit, using a torch, going through like stuff. Like, I think that there, that's something that I would like to see from this series going forward. I think it'd be really cool if there was some sort of like split story narrative or something. I don't know. I like, I, I don't know if it would have worked in this game. Like, okay, you you go back in time maybe and you play a Zelda in the past or something. I don't know if that would have worked because what would you do? Like, it, there's, it's this giant open world. What are you going to do? Op go be in the past in the open world of Zelda or something? Grant, that kind of sounds cool. Wait a second. Wait, that kind of sounds cool. Hold up. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Like the whole map is completely different. <laughs> Because it's in the past. Wait, that kind of sounds sick. Wait, hold up. But that would be them making an entirely new map again, which I they already did that like twice with the depths and everything in this game. But but again, like I I don't know. I I I didn't need it to happen, but I I think that would have would be something that I would love to see going forward. Is dude, like she made the ult ultimate sacrifice in this game, like. Let her be like I want to see her as the protagonist. Her her name is the damn game. <laughs> like the, the, it says her name right there. You know, like I know it's been that way, but it's just like I, I don't know. I, I I think that'd be super cool if there was something like like she has some uh you know 
Like if she has the recall abilities and then Link has other abilities, I don't know. Something they could have done. There's some evidence that Link and Zelda are living together in such a game. Yeah, I did see that in my playthrough, which was super cute. Yeah, I mean, my, my canon is that they are together. I mean, I think that makes sense. I mean, he literally has, like, saved her time and time again, right? I think Nintendo shipped them as hard as they could in Tears of Kingdom without making it official. I agree with everything you're saying, though. Yeah. I just realized we can see the last part of the mural. Have we always been able to? Um, oh, on the main menu? Oh, maybe not. That's super cool, if, if true. Maybe not. That was a great reveal, by the way. Yeah, I don't think they would have shown you this. Yeah, they definitely would not show you this in the menu. That It's such a spoiler. Yeah, that's cool. They add that. But yeah, no, that was a, that was a sick thing. It was it was very much in my brain. I'm not going to lie. I was like, oh, that's a very God of War moment. Um, you know, like th almost to a T similar, like not going to lie, like very similar. Like, like there's a mural that Kratos and Atreus find. And there's just this eerie part that's covered up. And then you don't find out what it is until like, you know. The last moments. And it was just like that in this game. It was just like that. But you already figured that, it out. In, in, in God of War, it reveals something. In God of War 2018, it reveals a potential future. And then, you know, the, you guys, I don't want to spoil God of War. We're not talking about God of War. But, like, it, it's more some reveals right then and there. But this is more like something you already know. The mural then kind of confirms, ah, that's what it was. Oh, cool, cool. You already knew that's where, where it, was, it was always meant to happen that way. Cool. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I, I, I think something I was going to say, chat, just thinking, sorry I'm talking so much, but I have so much to say about this game. Um, something I want to say is I think that if, they, if they're not planning on doing it, they need to do it. I want an animated movie. I want the next Nintendo movie so badly to be Zelda. Please, God. Like, you have so many awesome characters that you could have in a movie. Like, just think of Raru and Minoru and, and of course, Zelda. And like, all these characters. Like, they're, they are so much... To me, right now, like, they're way... Like, I, like, like again, I didn't grow up with Mario... Don't want I don't want to dog on my boy Mario. I know you guys love Mario. But to me, this is like I am so much more invested in Link and in Zelda than Mario and Princess Peach and all that sort of stuff. Um you know, I know it's it's probably I mean this was their story series, right? This is more of their their uh RPG series, but it's like I don't know. Like I I just think that a movie, I think there, there could be a really awesome script that you could do and a really awesome animation style. And it'd be really cool. And hell, you could use Tears of the Kingdom as the backbone of it, and it would probably work. Probably. Or, or Breath of the Wild or something like that. I really hope they do it. Again, other ones I played. I think, I think any of these games could work in some way. I think they're going to make a DLC for the Master Sword again. There's no damage number. There's no damage number on the Master Sword? I mean, yeah, maybe. I don't know. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what they do. I it feels so complete as well. Nintendo's been hitting some home runs on antagonist designs, Bowser's design, Bowser's Fury and Ganon in this game. Dude, Ganon's design. Also, shout out to Matt Mercer, dude. Shout out to Matt Mercer. What a phenomenal choice and just instant classic villain. Like gonna remember Ganon. If I ever see Ganon again, I it's gonna it's just gonna be oh god, I'm gonna get chills. Um he did he did really good. I really liked and I also liked they they use Matt Mercer as well because Matt's probably really good at doing voices for like what you know when they have to like pitch change. Ganon, 
Matt's got a really good voice for that where you can like, all right, let's let's like pitch change him where he's like really old and decrepit or whatever the right word is. I don't know what the right word is for that. But like we can like make his voice sound a little bit different there, but it's still Matt doing it, I think. And then there's also, you know, like other there's, there's I think he had like two or three variations of his voice in this game and they were all really good. And God, was it great to just have a fight with him with him using his like sort of like katana thing like that was sick dude like that was when that started happening and i was he was just going i was like oh my god we're playing sekiro right now what is happening dude this is crazy this is absolutely crazy it's so much more memorable than the calamity ganon i don't even remember how calamity ganon was i i don't even remember i literally don't even remember how it was no idea god imagine being approached and being told you're playing ganon yeah that's insane dude that is genuinely, genuinely insane. Oh my god. Oh, when I see it, Zelda moved to Baz, they don't cast Link, right? So he doesn't talk. Dude, that's so, yeah, it's so wild that he doesn't talk. It's so nuts. But it, it adds to that show don't tell thing. But as long as Link will tell other characters stuff with his hands at least, god dang it. Um... But yeah, aside from the story stuff I talked about earlier, I, I don't mind that he's silent. I, I don't mind it. I, I think I think it adds to the the music and the the visuals in another way. Game with Arsenal of Weapons was amazing. Yeah, that was really cool. That was really freaking cool. Jeremy Lee uh Lee voices Sonya, who voices Gage in Borderlands. V and Cyberpunk at anime roles as Asuna. Wait, what? Sonya was was the same voice as Asuna. What? No way. That's crazy. Zelda hinted at Link speaking, but very infrequently back in Breath of the Wild. Got it. Dang. Link doesn't talk because he wants to silently bear bear any burden. Also, you can, so you can immerse yourself into being Link more true. Yeah, it's kind of like a it's it's like Master Chief, right? Master Chief talked a little bit, but it, it, it's that same thing where it's like the more silent, the more that you can project yourself onto the character and really feel empowered by it. I mean, Elden Ring works the same way. You feel like an Elden Lord at the end of it. You're like, bro, I don't have to say anything. I'm here. And you hear that music play. It feels so good. I call the phenomena part the calm before the storm because it was so cookie cutter, but the payoff was worth it. I saw it as this is the part where you explore and take your time. Oh, the uh, like the the regions purgatory. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it definitely is. It definitely is the part where you you just go explore the world and stuff. For sure. I mean, again, like, it, these are just, like, the things that I'm talking about are just so, like, it's not the biggest deal in the world because the overall game is just so good. You know? I'm just I'm just throwing things out there to the wind. <sighs> God. I don't know what else. I don't know what else. I don't know what else I, I can even say about it. That person can help, but I consider my favorite game of all time. Dude, I totally can see this be someone's favorite, favorite game of all time. I don't think it's mine, but I think it goes down in my, like, I need to, like, sell on it some more. But I, I think, I think this game is, is, like, a top 10 game for me. I'm not sure where it would fall. But, like, just in terms of my favorites, it's not like, like, it's hard for me to, like, rank, like, what's best. Like, I, it's just, like, top 10 favorites. I have, like, games that people would be, like, no shot is that above this. But I, I, I it's just because they're my favorites, you know? It's hard. Like, I, I would say I probably would, like, I do like Bloodborne more than this game. If that makes sense. Even though, like, Bloodborne's, like, capped at, granted, this is capped at 30, right? But it's, like, Bloodborne has, like, performance like woes and everything still and and i i do like bloodborne more so i wouldn't say this is like this is not my favorite game of all time but like that's insane that i'm even thinking about it 
That's how good this game was. This this might be like again, like I said, like maybe like top three open world video game I've ever played. And in no particular order. Like I honestly don't know what exactly I'd put. This game is everything I want in an open world game. It checked literally every box for me personally. Damn. That's awesome. That's really awesome. Damn. The next game needs to bring the Triforce back. It's been absent for too long. Yeah, I mean, I have always I've always seen that logo and stuff, right? I've always known the word Triforce and everything, but I've never really understood it. So that would be cool. Because I, I don't really I don't really understand what it is too much. So you have about a movie. I think going animated from Zelda would be a safer bet. Oh yeah. Like like 2D or 3D? 2D? Can you imagine if they did like Spider-Verse or something? Like that'd be wild. <laughs> it'd be absolutely wild. You should sleep on it so you can be ready for violence at 16. Yeah, that's that's the other thing, chat. Oh my god. Oh my god. Like we're potentially in like in in maybe some of like the best gaming moments of my life right now like this game potentially like in my top 10 games i've ever played and then final fantasy 16 is coming out tomorrow which is i think final fantasy 16 i i think i've been more hyped for it than anything the last like two to three years for like a single story of a video game crazy i know but i i just like I'm not, and not even I wasn't even that hyped two years ago for it. It's actually just thinking about my level of hype. There's nothing that I've had the level of hype for, like sixteen. So I I really hope, yeah, we're in some good hands tomorrow with that. Good example I'll give is the Triforce is kind of like Zelda's equivalent. The Chaos Emeralds they work a bit differently. But see, I thought that's the Secret Stones, right? But I guess they added that on top. So like. It's kind of like the Master Emerald and all the Chaos Emeralds, right? I don't know. You have some relation or something. Yeah, I... I did anyone see this Ghibli style fan art poster for No, I didn't. I didn't. That sounds amazing, though. God. Chat, do you, I mean, do you guys have any any last thing, any last words on on Zelda before we kind of switch towards the ending of the stream vibes? Like on this game, on this game. I just don't, I just don't even know what to say. Like, I almost just want to think on it, but I'm also not gonna have a lot of time to think on it because Final Fantasy is tomorrow. In the past, if you assemble the Triforce, you get the power to seal the darkness. In this game, the Master Sword more so played that role, from my understanding. Favorite moment. Oh, that's good. Favorite moment. Aside from the end, like catching her. I, I mean, I think it's easy. I, I, th I think it's the watching the last tier and having the realization with the silent princesses, the flowers around the tier in the ground and having the realization that the dragon above you was her. Like having that realization was one of like my great, I, I genuinely said it. I was like that. I think that's one of the best gaming moments I've ever had in my life. Like, like, yeah, realizing that she was there the entire time, you know, realize because at first it was like a two, it was a two shock process for me. It was number one, oh my God, the master sword is somewhere in the sky. What the hell does that mean? I thought the master sword, once I found out the master sword was in the sky, 
I was like, this is crazy. Are they going to like do this thing where like I have to go and like time my jump and like glide to it as it's like spinning through the air or something? You know what I mean? Like imagine just like a thin sword just like spinning all across the open world map. That's what I thought it was at first when I saw like the dot on the map. I was like, oh. And I didn't, I had no idea that was the dragon. Um, and then once I did the tears, I thank God, thank God I didn't even see the dragon and, and like with the, the main objective marker for the sword or anything like that. Um, thank God I didn't see the dragon. Uh, and once I saw the tears and we finished that in the stream and it was like, okay, time to go do the map. Oh, what? Like it's all connected. Like that was mind blowing. Like the tears were connected to the master sword story and it was connected to Zelda and she was there the whole time and she made the ultimate sacrifice. And that was just beautiful. Like it was, it was like whoever came up with that at Nintendo, give them every amount of a raise, give them every praise. Beautiful, like beautiful gaming moment. And then the dragon as well, like when you see it in the in the in the cinematic, and then you realize that when when she when when she becomes the dragon, um, she cries, right? She cries out as the dragon, and then the the tears of the kingdom that spread out were her tears, like it was like her dragon tears when she became a dragon in that moment, and like. They just fly out, and those are the 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 magical glyphs and everything that you see are like one last memory bank from Zelda of her crying out in that moment. Like that is beautiful. Like when I think about it, I'm like, how, like that's such that's so well done. And and it, and it did a lot. Like in in those moments, it was so like just show don't tell. You know, it was just oh. Here's a, here's a cinematic about it. Here's her crying. There's the tears. You don't even got to tell me. I know what you're implying, you know? It kind of begs the question about the other three dragons. They were also once human. Yeah, I, I thought about that too. I was like, I remember thinking about that. I was like, wait, there's more dragons, right? And that would be, you know, super cool to, to, to know, like, wait, were there other stones? question mark what happened there i don't understand that that's that's very odd um i don't know um i also do want to apologize chat because in my playthrough the two things that i didn't do is i didn't really check out the other dragons too much i don't think at all i don't know why i just kind of forgot and then i didn't f i didn't kill the hydra things I did. I fought one for a bit one time and died, and I just never did it again. So I do want to apologize. I didn't do it. I know somebody mentioned it like the other day that like you gotta fight one before the playthrough is over. And I just didn't. I didn't. I failed you. Um, I never killed one. I never killed. One. At least I fought one for a little bit, but I never killed one. I still. Don't, I don't know what they do. Also, wait. Hold on. Hold on. No, no, no. Spoil it for me right now. What is a booble frog? What did those do? Why did I never find an answer to that? Wh what was the booble gem? What did that do? I collected so many of those, and for what? I have no idea what they did. You take them to a trader. You get different kind of masks that disguise you as a certain, a certain monster. What? What the, f where was that? Why did I, why did I never find, like, find that in the entire game? I'm hearing someone, the other three drives of three gosses. That'd be cool. I don't know. He also gives you armor that makes you lose rupees instead of health. <laughs> That's amazing. I love that. You first find him at Woodland Stable. Wow. I, I just miss that, I guess. You can get a Bo Cobblin mask and Link will do a Bo Cobblin idle animation. That's awesome. Another armor set you're, you miss is the frog suit. Dude, that's that's so cool. There's it's so much more stuff to do. I mean, all right, here, here's a question from 
what you guys are saying. Um, last one's the Lionel mask. That's sick. Here's a question. Would you... I don't know when, to be honest, because I really want to play Final Fantasy, obviously. But would you would you guys still want to watch Zelda at some point? Like, if I want to come back to it and 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 like not necessarily do all the Koroks I don't think I would ever do that but but like do things that like are kind of like loose there's a little bit of loose threads it's like okay what's up with the hydras all over the map what's up with the bones in that one place and all that kind of stuff um like again the exploring the depths more yeah get get the Hi. oh my god Jesus Christ <laughs> To water, get, getting uh, getting the rest of the X marks and the 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 depths could be cool too. I don't know. There's a there's a lot of a lot of cool stuff we could do. How to go ahead and finish it yet? So I didn't look. Oh, we're we're still talking about Dewaner, so be careful, be careful. But uh, I'm I'm just asking chat if they would like to see me play the game some more, like at some point in the future. I'll definitely watch you play more. Damn. I appreciate it, guys. Yeah. <laughs> Fierce deity armor is in depth. I've been lied to. No. I just finished getting all the light roots. Damn, dude. That's a long time. Oh, man. Enjoy that. Enjoy the light. There's 120. That's... How? 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 That's insane, dude. Ocarina would be cool to see during your classic game streams. Dude, I, I, I'd be down to play more Zelda games. Especially after this, I would love to 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 play more um of the classics for you guys. Again, give me give me some time to cook. I, I think I think I have some ideas of the future of like of doing of doing some like uh what's the word um doing some some classic games like i want to do some ff7 because i want to know how that story really really goes before i play rebirth i want to do you know i did pokemon this year for the first time um i would love to check out a mario some classic mario games and I feel like Zelda would make sense too. Like check out something like that too. You know, I don't know. I think I think I'm gonna have a moment like that where I'm just gonna want to go into like retro world <laughs> for a little bit. <laughs> I'm just gonna want to like go back into a retro world and just like check out some old stuff because there's been so many good games that like I'm almost to the point where like my brain can't handle it. It's kind of nuts. Don't let anybody tell you that 2023 hasn't been like one of the best years for games. Like I literally cannot believe the games that have come out this year. Hey, what's up, Winter? Hello. Let me let me shut the door so she doesn't know it. Hello. looking at my lamp she's very confused about the lamp anyways um yeah Final Fantasy 16 is out bro there's no shot that's out right now that comes out like tomorrow night or today to tonight at like 9 p.m are you like where are you at what country are you in there's no way it's out. Also, I literally couldn't play it. Like, I, I even if it came out right now, I I would have to go to bed. <laughs> like, I I would have to go to bed. Like, I can't, I can't, I could not focus on it. New Zealand, you're so lucky, dude. You're so lucky. God dang it, dude. New Zealand, always, man. You're so lucky, man. You're so lucky. Enjoy it if you're playing it. Oh. Want to see one or two older Zelda, Zelda trailers? Um, 
I don't know, man. I I almost don't know if I want to do that yet. Cause I I I think it'd be cool, but I also think it'd be it could be really cool to not know too much. Cause like, what if like, I'm like, okay, let's play twilight princess or something like you guys are saying. I have, I have no context for what that is. <laughs> like I have no context. Like think about how rare that is. Like, I don't, I don't know. It's like with Mario games. Like I, I, I just don't know too much. Um, did, did Winter just turn off my switch? What'd she just do, bro? I don't know. Um, I'm kind of curious. I'm gonna look at my my switch really fast, and I want to know how many hours it says. Yeah, we're over seventy hours. It's official. That's crazy, guys. Seventy hours. Seventy hours it took. Seventy hours. But yeah, um. I th I think I think actually I know you guys are saying maybe watch some stuff. I know Grim was maybe wanting wanting me to watch some, but I'm like I'm kind of thinking a I should a give my brain a rest and then b I think it'd be cool not to know because then when the time comes, then it'll be like oh shoot, this guy really doesn't know what Twilight Princess is, and I'm like no I I really don't, <laughs> and it that would be a wild playthrough, you know what I mean, stuff like that. I think it's I, it's kind of like Emmy Emmy playing zombies for the first time. It's like what you haven't played Nocturne and Toten, and it's just like no, you know, like it's it's just really cool. So yeah, maybe we'll do something like that. Waker is my favorite characterization of Yandorf. That's hype. Oh man, do so you have to wait another day for it to come out? Yeah, I have to wait. Well, it's technically today, Ben. It comes out at nine p.m. and it's five a.m. So it comes out at like. What, like 14 hours, right? No, 16 hours, 16 hours. So I got some time. I got some time to go sleep. Thank God. Skyward Swords on the Switch. Hell yeah. Okay, Winter, what is she doing? Oh, she's like messing with the light, dude. Winter, you can't be really doing that, right? She's like so interested in the lamp. Anyways, um, I don't know, guys. This this has been this has been phenomenal. I don't know what else to say. I do not know what else. Oh, she's going to the bathroom. I was like, what's that noise? This has been phenomenal. Um, I just want to say before I conclude this part of the vod, um. I just want to say to every single person that has worked on this, there's no shot you're watching my stream, but that's okay. But to every single person that has worked on this game, like just thank you so much. And like shout out to you guys making genuinely one of like the best open world games ever in history that games are going to just learn from and learn from and learn from and try to replicate and try to even come close to the design principles that you had like i as someone who really likes game design like i am just constantly amazed at the game design that is all within this game like they have to build land masses that have just enough where you can like ascend up them with the ascendability and then if they and then if they have a place where they don't want you to do that they have to like think about that the whole time when they're developing a room oh we got to make sure that he can't ascend up here we got to make sure he can't ascend there like i came in like dude like things like that just probably take so much time making this game and it's just it's just insane I saw an interesting video talking about the concept of how Nintendo funnel people into getting people to important places. Yes, I saw that too, to honor. Uh, I think I did. The, um, the one where the guy talks about the shrines and stuff. I think I saw that too. Yeah. Yeah, it's super cool. They made the shrines like green and like catches your attention. We'll watch tomorrow when you're playing. I probably won't get far. I will have sleep. I have to sleep for work. Hey. 
I will be playing it for days, Ben. So feel free to stop by at any point and, and talk about at least up to where I am. Uh, cause no spoilers of course, but, but dude, I can't wait. It's gonna be fun. Just so you're gonna continue from the prologue or start again, Final Fantasy 16. I just want to know, cause I'm going to play a prologue. Okay. Let's, let's do this. Let me, let's wrap up Zelda and then let me move my attention towards what we're doing next. But that's a really good question. But all I will say is this before, let me wrap up the Zelda VOD really quickly right here. Okay. Cause this, this bit goes on our VOD channel. Thank you to everyone. Even if you weren't here for the final episode or the last episode or whatever, 13 episodes of Zelda. That is a lot. It's one of our longest uh, playthroughs on the channel. And I just got to say, thanks guys. Like the cat is literally like destroying litter in the other room right now. But uh, just thank you so much. Like this playthrough was in some ways, I don't want to get really deep, but this game and Breath of the Wild as well are very calming to play. Like, sure, they can be stressful at times, but there's like a calmness to them that, that really helped me out the last couple of weeks. Um, I'm in a lot, I'm in a much better place mentally right now, honestly, than you probably would expect with everything that's been going on the last couple of months. But I, I can't stress it enough that like this game came at a really good time for me. And streaming this game was just a really, it was almost like therapeutic. I don't know how to explain that. It just, it was so just positive vibes and just good feelings. And the way that it ended, you know, uh, without spoiling, because Dwanner, Dwanner's in the chat, but the way it ended just like, when it made me cry, like, I think it's just because of all those things, maybe. Like, I don't know. It's just like, it was, it was like therapeutic in some ways. Um, and I think this game's gonna be really special to me for a while. and. I don't know. I appreciate you guys. I, I appreciate you guys being here and, and thank you for letting me share it with you because it is, um, yeah, it's, it's, it's a lot of, a lot of content to consume. Um, but it will all exist on that VOD channel and on Twitch, um, for all eternity, hopefully until, until the zone, I come down and, and they use the time stone and then it doesn't exist anymore. I'm glad you got to play it. I'm glad I watched. Hey, I appreciate Purgatory. Thank you. And thank you to everybody who helped too. We had so many like things across all the episodes where I needed help with certain things. And I appreciate everybody being like pretty, pretty good. And like, we didn't really have any like crazy spoilers that like ruined the game or anything like that. So appreciate that too. Like, thanks. Thanks for keeping it, keeping it clean and uh, shout out to mods, like whisper in the chat. Uh, like, like just making sure that no one's saying anything dummy um and spoiling stuff really appreciate you with uh whisper thanks for being here for like a majority of this playthrough you're here like on almost every single one dude like thank you um but yeah this 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 game is gonna go down in history is one of the best open world games of all time and i'm really glad i played it and i'm really glad you guys were there for it so thank you so damn much um that's gonna be it for me that's all my thoughts on the game right now uh the rest i just need to sit on sit on it and think about it amazing Amazing. Ah. <sighs> now what? <laughs> oh.